Okay, hi. Uh, there it is. <laughs> oh, wow. Um, I can't believe I'm doing this. Alright, uh, so here's the deal. I'm gonna get out of here. Uh, <laughs> I feel so weird. Alright, so I'm leaving the mall. It's uh, Friday the 23rd. And oh, oh, oh. I just. Hi! Hi, I didn't know it. Merry Christmas. <laughs> um, anyways, I'm leaving the mall with. Uh, Danny's Christmas gift, all right? And, whoop, I wait for a car. Gosh, I can't believe how stupid I feel. <laughs> uh, go ahead. Oh, anyway. Um, so, here I am <laughs> filming myself. I had to leave work early in order to make it to the store on time. And, uh, gosh, I was stressing so much the importance of getting this size right, right? But, uh, here, so I can get a little more light. But I, but I got it. I got it. <laughs> oh, now I'm being looked at. Okay, well, <laughs> hi. Um, baby, I, I know this is last minute and this is just kind of weird. It's kind of, oh, here we go. Not uh, something I typically do, but <sighs> you gotta admit, when you see this, I did good. I did really good and I cannot wait to see you tomorrow and share Christmas with you and oh looks like security's gonna get me I better get going um baby basically I wanna I wanna spend the rest of my Christmases with you I love you so much and I just <laughs> I can't wait to see you tomorrow baby I love you tell us to it here's the deal so what I did was I had Melissa uh, Danny's good friend distract her with a happy hour. I don't know how Melissa pulled it up, but she, she you know what they're tight um, But the thing is I need to get into the house with this package because Danny is always ruining my surprises It drives me crazy and she's not gonna win this time. All right, so Problem is we're cutting a little close. I mean, it's 615. She's gonna be back around 6:30, 6:45, depending so I'm really hoping I can get this in the house, on the tree, like I planned, and go from there. Oh, I gotta go. Um. Okay. Oh, nice. I think it's gonna work. Right. There we go. Does that work? Yeah. Okay. I see. Yeah. All right. So, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna hide it in here. And uh, and then tomorrow night when she comes home. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah. Hey, how was uh, Melissa? Oh, she's fine. Yeah. Stop talking. Get in the camera. Just hold on a second. Why? Well, um, why? Uh, well, okay. The reason why is because you're hilarious, and I want my mom to know. Also, just repeat what you just said. <laughs> No. Yes, that was kidding? hilarious. No, I just no. need a little proof. I'm not repeating myself. Babe, that was funny. Remember what you said last Christmas? Just say that. Oh, no. What? That wasn't that bad. That was a one-time deal. What do you mean a one-time one -time deal? deal? Please. Oh, that Come is on. Not, that is not going on record. Absolutely not. <sighs> no. Isn't the kind of thing you women want to impress your future mothers-in-law? Um, wow! I, well, we, Mr. Hilarious. Well, I don't know, maybe. Okay, you're right. I'm not funny, but no, not usually. <laughs> you're adorable. Um, come on, babe. Please, just do it for me. No. Do it. No, I don't perform on command. Besides, I'm not really, you should. Oh, wow! Well, is it eight o'clock yet? Oh, it is. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Merry Christmas to me. Hmm. Wow. I love you. I do. I love you too. Jerk. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, you know, there is one more gift we haven't opened. Um, no. They're all... Yes. No, trust they're... me, there is. So um, stay there. Stay put. Okay, well, I already gave you all your coal. Aha, uh -huh, I know you did. Thanks for that. <laughs> See, I told you. 
I'm not the funny one. Cut crew. We cut crew from the budget. You had a budget? See, now you're hitting on my main point. cool thing about Grey State is that what we're doing it from the standpoint of the marketing and taking our time and uh, gathering our resources and getting ready to push it at the right moment is something that most films around the Twin Cities aren't doing. Out in Hollywood or out in New York or Chicago, whatever. They do these things. Around here, nobody does that. I'm really impressed with the marketing aspect of Grey State. The photos look amazingly professional. The, the website looks incredible. All of these things lend a professionalism and a high production value to something that isn't even made yet that, will, uh, that attracts attention. It demands attention. The more that Dave and Mitch apply their knowledge to the marketing aspects, it makes it comparable to huge budget features and it draws the eye. The trailer is almost secondary to the concept push itself. We are generating something like 25 behind the scenes videos. They're pushing this concept showing that, yeah, we planned for this and we did this and this is what we get. And this is with no budget. And we've already passed a lot of local films on Facebook in popularity and we're just, we're in hibernation. If we approach an investor with a completed trailer and we have 10,000 Facebook fans, you know, a movement behind it, that's already a sale. Filmmakers have not been able to utilize the resources that they can through Facebook and the marketing aspect on it and figure out, first off, who's your demographic? How's your, who's your niche? How are you going to contact the people who actually have deep pockets? What's your plan of taking the film to the next level? How are you going to be able to distribute it? How are you going to get in contact with those people? It's a big marketing package. And we hand these, like, go to a potential investor or something like that. We give them these things like, this is what we have done. This is what we are prepared to do. How dedicated we are to this project. And with your help, we can make this project. Conversations I've had with other actors and other directors, uh, we've, we've talked about uh, the detail and how much time and effort is going into uh, just a trailer. Most concept trailers never see the light of day or never really get off the ground, let alone you're putting a lot of funding and money into a product that you're hoping to lead to the actual production of the film itself. A lot of work has gone into the concept trailer because they're looking to sort of show this as a very wide concept, a very big, broad-based concept that envelops in an entire country. So it's going to take a lot of work. These things definitely take time. It's all about the quality. It's not a about the quantity. And this is where people get really confused because a lot of filmmakers are like, well, I'm going to pump out films like this, shorts, boom, boom. And when they do that, it's like this. I think so much work has gone into a concept trailer because they believe 
in what they're writing about. I know with David and Mitch as filmmakers, they wanted to do a lot of things and they wanted to push the barrier and the envelope as much as possible. There's a ton of uh, detail, a, a lot of footage, a lot of options to, to do a lot of different things. And in addition to just one standard trailer, there's huge opportunity to do ongoing promotion. If you guys put this much effort into it, then you care about what the story's gonna be. And to me, that's the most important thing. The mistake I think a lot of, uh, of film producers and directors make is that they send it out and they, it's kind of uh, send it out and they will watch it. And maybe they will, but the way Facebook and the internet works, things are there and gone in a millisecond. So you really have to put together a campaign to, uh, to get that, that information out there. All this buzz that people have for Gray State, we didn't start it. You know, we just started shooting. We started doing a scene here, a scene there involving people that we wanted and it just generated from there. It was crazy. We didn't do anything to hype the film at all. All the hype has come from people being on set. The people who have worked on Gray State already are like evangelists. I kid you not. The more people that were brought on to Gray State, the more they started talking about it and publicizing it, and it just became this huge buzz. Like, tell me more about Gray State. Hey, how can I get on that set? People working on feature films being shot during the same time. The cast and crew on that feature film was talking about Gray State. I think everybody's in anticipation. But we knew we had to use that hype for our own good and push that because we knew it being successful was going to be built on word of mouth and grassroots. The things that we're showing, the things that we're saying are appealing to people. And it's making it a very popular idea. I think people are finally seeing a film that it's a direct reflection of what reality is actually becoming. And I think people are, at this point, are extremely happy and excited for uh, a project like this to show that. I think there's a huge amount of potential for the Gray State uh, idea. The incredible professionalism of the, of the shoot, the really awesome look of the trailer. I think it's going to get some attention, and I think uh, it's going to get some, some budgetary attention, some financial attention, which it, it really deserves. I think Gray State would definitely run into some problems because they're pushing the envelope. With anything that's pushing the envelope or trying to get a message out there that maybe not everybody agrees with, you're going to have some things you're running with. I think it's going to go over well with uh, whomever you show it to. I think it'll go over well with them, whether they want to actually give us money to do it, I, who knows. The way that it's being done, I mean, the interviews, doing a trailer and not just shooting the feature, we can get investors interested in the project so that we can get funding, so that we can actually make something that's great. We are saying, well, anyone can make a movie these days because for three grand you get pro quality gear. Well, <laughs> yeah, it's all what you do with it. A tube of paint is cheap, but not everyone's Picasso. So. Because in this day and age, not only are we talking about creating an effective story, but this story can only be produced if it's got the financial backing to create it. I'd like to see him get it made and have it actually go somewhere and be noticed as being something that got made in Minnesota. And wow, they pulled something off with nothing. Is immensely ambitious and requires a great deal of financial backing, uh, let's be honest. So they understand that a good concept marketing piece like a trailer with posters and websites, distribution ideas, really the effectiveness of how they can create the story, knowing all that ahead of time so that they can offer this to investors so that they know that what they're investing in knows what they're doing and will immediately not have any question about any aspect of the production. David and Mitch and Danny have already answered those questions for any investor that has them. Hopefully we get some fantastic funding so we can make a bomb movie. And we can. There's no doubt in my mind. There's enough uh, resources here and talent to actually do it. My idea on doing films in the Twin Cities is pretty much this is our home and we can do everything that they can do on the West Coast. And now all we have to do is show them that we can do it. We obviously have the talent, we have the people in Minnesota. We have the military group, Bullet Exchange. We have open air action design. We have great camera people, great directors, great production companies. All we have to do is come together and show that we can do exactly what they do out there. And to have all those pieces kind of come together for a local film and to work that great really surprised me and made me happy too because that's obviously our ultimate goal. It'd be fun to see the finished product. Oh, it's going to be great. People are going to love it. They're going to get some funding and then we're all going to get a job. <laughs> It's a professional, intelligent film. Uh, it's, it's groundbreaking on what it's trying to do from the visual aspect to the storytelling to the production. I'd like the feature to be so good that people outside of Minneapolis are like, wow, 
again because I don't think that anybody ever says wow when they think of Minneapolis. Gray State is making waves. This is just within the regional aspect. This is before we start doing our national. We have generated this concept that has resonated with people. With just the promise of a concept trailer, we're competing with other local feature films that have already got their budget, already shot, and they're on the downslope already. We're looking at the upslope. I can't see Gray State not being a success. It's definitely going to knock it out of the park. It will get funded. It will be shot, and it will be made. This is the rise. We're just starting out. That is my favorite part about Gray State, is that I hardly need to sell the concept. Oh, working on Great State was such a positive experience, and I was so glad to be a part of it. And I hope, sincerely, that we can move on to a feature film where I can work with these guys day in and day out and be a part of a really exciting process. You getting my good side? I don't know. Do you have a good side? I'm feeling really good about the game plan. I'm excited for it, man. I'm excited, I'm stoked. I'm looking forward to the whole thing. I play the uh, bad guy in the film. Um, sort of the face of the concept to be behind the great state world. Uh, my character, John Wanick, the leader of the resistance. Uh, people call them militia. It's a symbol of liberty and hope amongst this tyranny world that we live in. But underlying themes, he represents something much larger, something greater within the world of spiritualism. Something scarier than losing just liberty within this physical world. It's each part of the code as the warrior code. Um, we'll be hinting at that this time around, which is way more terrifying than any kind of physical enslavement of person. All right, well, well, we're here. Finally, we actually just got the van out. We got stuck. I guess the blizzard that came down here hit them, and the snow was all gone, but the ground's still wet and muddy. So we kind of know where we are a little bit, but the town is abandoned. Oh all yeah, it. it's gonna be fun. Looks like it's gonna be a fun day tomorrow. Awesome footage for Gray State, and uh, we're gonna go back to uh, we're gonna unload. We're gonna scout locations. We're gonna yeah. meet up with the American Milson guys. Geared up, baby. Might, might do some, 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 some fun stuff see where tonight. it goes. But uh, stay tuned. There's more coming. It's gonna be an adventure. What's up guys, David Crowley from the Gray State team, Danny Mesa. We're finishing up day two here in Oklahoma, doing a field shoot. A couple sneak peeks of what the players are going to be experiencing tomorrow. Also, we got to shoot a quick seg segment for Oath Keepers, and a couple things for Gray State, and we're getting ready for an exciting day tomorrow. Some explosions, some pyro, some flares, some smoke. <laughs> Mr. Mason's going to hurt himself, and yeah. uh, we're going to get some good stuff. This is essentially a big abandoned town. I think there's like 18 people who actually live here. And uh, we met like basically the mayor and people who own all these buildings. They're all decrepit. There's a creepy playground. There are uh, abandoned schools, abandoned warehouses, and uh, oh my god, there's uh, massive junkyards. Auditorium, it's abandoned, blown out. And what's happening tomorrow is there's going to be a game, an airsoft game, a milsim game with something like 470 people. What we do here at Gray State is take advantage of things when they pop up. So, we're going to roll on it, and it will be a scene at Gray State. Hopefully, we'll just inject Danny into the action and see what happens. Thanks for 
watching, and tomorrow we'll have more for you. So stay tuned. Stay tuned. What's up guys, we're the Great State Crew, we're here in Roosevelt, Oklahoma, and this is our third update video. Have fun, kill, be mean, be vicious, be ugly, and kick some serious ass! We're here with uh, Bo from American Milson. Bo, take it, what did we do today? Oh man, we had a great day, a lot of exciting stuff going on out there, we had some great direct action missions, a lot of guys, 400 guys acting out full military simulation, it was great, awesome. And we at Gray State take advantage of good opportunities, and so what we did is we just rolled video on all of it. You know, a lot of it will make it into the next Gray State promotional videos or the next trailer, or who knows, even the feature. But what we're about to do right now is about uh, 9.30 or 10 at night, yep. and we're about to use this location, this abandoned city street, to get some footage for Gray State. It's been a while. It has. We, have, we haven't shot Gray State since 2011, so we're looking forward to it. We've got some other volunteers, and uh, these are the Patriots. It's a fantastic opportunity to be in this town and have access. Yeah, we're able to take yeah. full. Did you see this? this? Yeah, we're walking yeah. town. There's a post office right here. Right yeah. behind it. It is occupied. There's a city hall. There's a bank and city hall. So I don't know how you combine the two, but apparently they figure out a way. It's like the only place in the country where you can walk around with an AR-15 and people are just waiting. Wait. <laughs> what? It's no big deal. Hi. Hey, what's up? Hey, hey comes up. Yeah. All right, so we're looking forward to doing some shooting tonight, and uh, we'll get this video out as soon as we can, and there's going to be a lot more tomorrow, so stay tuned, guys. The tribes of men came together What is the gray state? Are we living in it now? Are we headed towards it? When we survey the American landscape, symptoms of it appear everywhere. But do we really notice? Do we really care? We're here with uh, Jeff Baldwin, and uh, you saw the gray state trailer. I saw the trailer. I thought it was fantastic. I really hope they can get the money together to make that, to make that movie. Amy, so I want to ask you, have you heard about the gray state movie project? Yes, I have. Who hasn't? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's awesome. I'm super stoked. I can't wait for it to get made and get put out. And let the world see what really happens if we fail here today. This is this is going to be a movie. Yeah. It'll be in all the theaters, right? Good for you guys. Yeah. Congratulations. Mainstream media, in effect, has usurped our traditional heritage of storytelling as a means of passing on our culture. As an anti-culture, all we have are movies. So the mainstream media, in that usurpation of that, they've been able to dominate what we see and hear and what we pass on to our children. So imagine if we get a film like Grey State showing in a 1984 sort of format certain consequences of a failure to embrace liberty. Oh, dude, is it like a narrative? The movie. Right, yeah, it's not like a documentary. No, no, it's an actual movie. I think that's an important distinction to make is that it's not a documentary. Where a documentary will pander to a certain crowd who already subscribes to those beliefs, this is a narrative film. It's a literal movie you're going to go to the theater and see. So just imagine the possibilities there. Uh, the point is, is that this is where you're actually able to reach people. And a fictional account of near future paralleling reality, I think, is a great way to go. It's uh, definitely, instead of just being just an action uh, film, it's definitely more of a narrative film, character-driven piece, and that's what we're uh, sticking to our guns with on it. Definitely, it's something that you know I feel that can really unite everybody, especially if they see the real life of what can happen. I, I think so. Yeah, I just saw the trailer just a few days ago, and I really liked it. I, I hope it spreads. Look at the trailer for this; it's stunning. I've described it to people when they ask me what it's about. I say, well, it's kind of like Red Dawn 
if instead of the enemy being the Soviets, it was FEMA. Do you think that a movie like this could unite all underneath one kind of idea to be able to overthrow this tyrannical government? That we're it's considerably possible. Man. I mean, television, movies, film, media uh, have, can, can, do have that power to kind of, you know, that subversive element where you can watch a movie, you know, suspend disbelief. In this case, there's, there's not much to suspend. This is all happening. So, but yeah, absolutely. I think movies, music, art, very, very powerful to promote messages of liberty. If everybody could see something in a storyline, in a movie, and be like, right, wow, right, like the right. Hunger Games thing, and the V, and yeah, all yeah, those other yeah. previous movies. Yeah, a few years ago that was crazy science fiction. Now it's, it's almost foreboding. Right? Well, then, no, actually, no one, no one goes there. But that's where it goes. That's possible. You piece it together and you move music around and you can still move and educate. And you can piss people off, but you won't really scare them too much. You're watching someone get their head beat by a cop. But when you think futuristically, you know, George Orwellian kind of, you know, how bad could things get? And if they escalated a couple more steps from where we are now, even though it may not be there on the surface, what would be the final straw? I, I want to get it out there and get a reaction let people see it. I thought it was a good trip. It's awesome. It's you know, really I don't want to wait two easy. years because that might be coming a lot faster than you think. Exploring a scenario like this from the current paradigm is the only way that you can do it, but it's a very important exercise to look forward and consider that possibility with, with the hopes of averting it. But at the same time, you have to look at that and go, holy fucking shit, we're halfway there. We just got through watching the trailer for Grey State, and to be honest, it pisses me off that the country's come to this, but both myself and my best friend here are combat marine veterans, and we're not going to sit here and just take this lying down. How many here have seen the Grey State trailer? That is what's coming down the road. Now why do I sound so urgent? You know what the NDAA is, don't you? It is the Declaration of War on the American People. That's exactly what it is. Authorizing military force, that's killing you, military detention, and military trial, or rendition to some foreign country. That is exactly the kind of abuse of power that led to the first American Revolution. What we're seeing is is that it's a, it's a split between patriots and loyalists. This is what's happening across the country. People are choosing sides right now. You know, the people who will, you know, just do what the party wants and do what they're told and vote the way they're told and they just keep voting for the machine. Despite what people might think, this is actually a lot closer to happening than everybody really believes. Everybody labels us as conspiracy theorists but that's just because people are stuck in their own denial and they don't want to believe that something like this can actually happen to them. When you guys decided to do a serious movie that's literally going to scare people, let's face it, it's going to scare people. You look at, you know, Germany and you go, it didn't happen in a day. And, it's, and people that have survived that and lived to talk about it go, it didn't happen in a day. And if that person saw your movie, they'd be nodding going, yep, yep, yep. But we don't know this. I, I think that we have no idea what happens in a monetary collapse. And that's, and that's where we're going. The government would have to prop itself up, and it would be through a police state. And at very minimum, I see this as, a, as an awakening just because it might get people to start to prepare. That's you know, at least right. because you, the future is uncertain. Right. You don't know what's going to happen. Yeah. And most people have less than a week's worth of food in their house. True. I mean, we have a, a monetary collapse. What's going to happen? Stores are going to shut down. Right. What happens when those trucks keep stop rolling, right? Right. right. It changes people's uh, outlook on, on what does transpire. Empty empty shelves. What do I think? <laughs> About damn time. <laughs> and it needs to show some of the blood and guts in there because most people haven't got that much perception of that. And that's what'll happen. But the feedback has been divided as we knew it would be because there are people are like, wow, someone finally is doing this. The rest of the people are like, I don't believe in that. So this no. is gonna be a stupid movie. No. That can't be real. So it's going to be a terrible movie, so I don't want to hear anything about it. But I wonder if they thought the same thing about Toy Story, like, hey, 
Tories don't talk. <laughs> this movie sucks. And um, that, that's just good for us because if they can't accept that it's that close to their reality, that if it creates that negative reaction, well, that's fine. That's fine. That means that we're doing our jobs. Yeah. But I mean, obviously it shows economic collapse, takeover, people being rounded up. All those real preparations are being made. So regardless, you know, I mean, just the trailer you've made helps give people kind of an image of where this is going to go if we just decide that anything in a uniform's God, well, the corrupt system will take that as a signal to move forward. If that's gray state, we're already at light gray state. <laughs> you know, and it's all shades of gray, right? The true the reality of what, of what can take place, yeah. I mean, when pe people have no idea, and nor do I, and this is this is your this is your project. That's David and Mitch's project. Yeah, I'm but, it, but it it raises that awareness. I mean, just by looking at the trailer, the concept is is awesome. The message uh, of the possible loss of freedom here in our country is something that a lot of Americans just don't like to come to grips with. That this movie would help them realize what is at stake and the consequences of it. It's coming. It's coming soon. And when it happens. Nobody's going to be ready for it. It's going to be so brutal because we don't pull any punches. This, this is not our, our game to look, pander to the lowest common denominator. We're going to make it as brutal as we possibly can because that is the reality we're facing. And it's up to the people to help us out. Believe me, the trailer is kick-ass. And I mean, if you were to walk in a movie theater and see a two-minute trailer and it was a hack job done by crappy editing and lousy uh, CGI, you would go, what's this piece of shit? That's not what you will say when you see the two-minute teaser. And well, the reason they put that together and they, and they did that hard work is because, again, these guys got to do it on their own dime. And that means we can help them out. Maybe, you know, Bubble listeners and, of course, Dangerous Conversation and Radio Isle listeners can hit their website, get on that PayPal, or, or we'll find out how they can uh, drop them a dime or two. So if you go to Indiegogo.com slash Movie. You're actually buying something. You're going to get these shirts. You're going to get some props. You're going to get posters, but you're going to contribute to the film. And the number one thing is that we need all of that grassroots support to funnel into something like Indiegogo so we can actually harness on the hype while it's there. What do I think? Yeah, let's get her out. That's not his thing. When did you guys start working on this? Two years ago. I was going to say, it's <laughs> you guys need to get that funding so you can make that. That's why I'm here. Well, no, this, I mean, the fight is at its core spiritual, and, 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 and you'd have to be in deep denial and delusion spiritually now to not know that the shadows are getting long here. I know that I'm speaking to people who are awake, and I know that I can count on your support. Grey State has already been described as a prophetic look into a terrifying future, but I appeal to you here today to help us prove them wrong. For a united effort, we keep this film in the fiction section. Every new person we reach is a new network. Out of every hundred people who see the trailer, maybe one person chips in five bucks. And so if we get the trailer seen by a million people, then I'm not too good at math, but that's, that's probably ten dollars at least. Google Great State movie, definitely. Google Great State movie. It's gonna be awesome. We gotta hurry up and get this going because I want to be alive when the shit goes now. The anxiety's getting to me. I know they got a few more stints they can put in me and a few other things to prop me up, but I'm tired of monkey shitting around. Let's get her done. Yeah, we've gotten like 300 fans in the past three days. <laughs> I know, I saw that. You know what it is? It's being more, I think it's probably been getting more interactive and also like... Oh, well, it was before all that. Oh, it was? Really? 
Shit, son. Those are empty, yeah? No, these are full. Full mags? Yeah. Oh, within the belt? Uh, yeah, they were. Can you do me a favor and put those in my green bag? That makes sense why these are, you got these guys, tits. three tits in here. Yeah, there should be three fakes down there. Oh, um, yeah, I found two. So I, there's probably one just floating in there. Okay. That in which green bag, David? My backpack. Cool. Okay. What are you doing all this stuff, man? Huh? What's that? Oh. What's up, buddy? How does he not break everything in here? You know? It's crazy, right? It's pretty gentle sometimes. But then he turns into like a fridge train. He's like, well, he just it. wants everybody to do it. That's just it. Yeah, dude, if you see this. Oh, gosh. Gotcha. Did Scab just fall off it? Right there, that's where you got nailed by the uh, the dog. Oh, the buddy. Side of his face right there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, we have five viewers already. Oh, wow. Cool. All right, guys, can you hear me? Just uh, tune in on chat and uh, say something if you got me. Six viewers. Chat, chat, chat. Yeah, it's working on my end, so if you guys have any problems with the audio or the video, just uh, let us know, and we'll come back and check the chat every now and then to address the issues. Okay, we're, we're just setting up right now. We're going to get the lights going and uh, do a walkthrough and so forth, kind of uh, get the feel for tonight. For those of you just tuning in, which should be everyone, this is sure to be a very boring process <laughs> if you're unfamiliar with how film shoots go. So um, go away or stick around or whatever. It's going to be fun. Oh, nice. Uh, black shirt. Yeah. Yeah, and I do want to uh, go pro. I think I'll hook it up to the gray safe poster. Yeah, I want you to observe the process. Yep, for setting up for the GoPro. For everything. Okay, so you're taking over this spot. Uh, this is spot. Just an extra hand. You should know stuff. Check out, we're going to have better shoots than what we had before. Already, it's. Stuff yeah, I was like, oh, oh what? I need you to run down to my car. Yep, we need. Okay. Behind the driver's seat. Driver's seat. Where the feet go for the passenger behind? Yep. Right. There should be a screw. A screw that looks like this. Actually, why don't you just do it when Jake shows up? Yeah. Because you got to go pick him up anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, this should be cool. There you go. Okay, your keys are here. Any nuts? All right. Um, yeah, how's the stuff going with the B-roll? I'm doing like two or three shoots a day. What do you get? Um, Mel's usually my stand in. She did uh, cool. typing on that's some real nice macro stuff, typing all the time, just like lights flickering. It was mostly for the, uh, the Google algorithm thing. So I got <laughs> some like tilt shift effects on the screen as she's typing shit in and clicking on stuff. It's been Dude, some tax documents. Dude, yeah, all the stuff to knock out, totally. Everything I can do at home, I think I've done, except for I've got some more. <clears throat> cool. I think I've got some more stuff. Okay, right. so I got my jeans, got my boots, sir. Got your sure. jeans? Yeah, hey, why don't you get dressed if it's not too hot? Uh, I'm going to pull off and just... Are you hot right now? That's just a little bit. I'll be sweating balls. Got 11 viewers. I'm going to. I'm sharing the link. 
do. Um, but yeah, that uh, checking out that that website. Uh, website. What were you talking about? You're like shit, man. Who said it doesn't act like a? Oh, is it your, oh, yeah, your, yeah, your okay. witty your witty comebacks? Yeah. Um, dude, I have some of those. I know you. You, you are witty that way. Don't give me that, man. You're, you do have witty comebacks. Um, dude, awesome though. My God. But of course, you know. Did he email you? He, uh, Steve just messaged me on Facebook. Okay. I was just said, hey, you know, I'll help promote my boy, that sort of thing. We also have a great estate, plus we take, we have a whole company and three trained dogs. So I'm like, yeah. Forever in New England. Kinetic career? Yeah. That place is awesome, though. Okay, well, I want to explain this to you so you know for next time. Are you busy? Channel. No okay. cap. Alright. Well, the deal with this is that the GoPro will put out its own specific Wi Fi network. So mm -hmm. if you download the GoPro app on your phone, you can control it. Yeah. So uh, you throw open the app. And it's a lot easier than you know, doing the menu on here. Yeah. A little, a little bit more stable. A little bit moist. Can you get a little bit moist, or do you have trouble doing that? Oh, that dude just seems to get the hot. You get all with it. It's amazing. Okay, the GoPro is hooked up. We're just getting a time lapse of what we're going to be doing tonight. Situation. Then. Yeah. Well, shoot. Since now, now that I see your layout, I imagine that this was a window instead of a door for some reason. I guess I haven't been here enough. But a door will work just fine. So just going to pump a couple of lights in 1K. It'll be fine. 2K if you need to. Yeah. I'm still listening. And maybe an, maybe through that window too. It'd be, yeah. It'd be kind of cool to backlight you that way. Uh, it's kind of what I was thinking, but also too, through the smoke with the natural 
Yeah, so I mean, the smoke, is, the smoke is only for atmosphere. Just yeah. a little bit, let it dissipate, just yeah. so it catches light. Hey! Leave it. But I want to get this variation through the uh, last work here. Yeah. Because I was hoping you guys see the lines, right? Yeah, that's fine. Basically, this is system three, right? And also, we're fine for the dollar for the trailer. System three. This is going to be where the this is it's trees and boom that part, and that's when lights come through the through the through the through the trees. Yeah. So we got. What's wrong? Yep. Hello. Uh, no, it's not actually. I'll be right down. Oh, fuck you, man. I'll be right there. That's it. Oh, that's like All right, guys, the crew is arriving and we'll be uh, getting ready to go here pretty quick. Okay, I'm going to try to read your questions as I go. Sorry if I'm not too attentive. It's just uh, we have a small crew tonight. Uh, how long are we going to stream? We're going to stream for as long as the internet works and uh, my laptop battery holds out. Any second SWAT is going to bust in and order everyone down. That's pretty much what's going to happen. You're not going to see it happen exactly in the scene. It's pretty much... Yeah, what we're going to be doing here, what the point of this scene is... Uh, this is like the veteran who comes home from war and he sees what's going on in the world and he's ready for it. And this is when uh, society has turned to the point where he's getting the knock, right? So you got the knock on the door, lights through the windows, flashing police sirens and so forth, and he knows that it's time. So he's got to load up and uh, it's, it's a do or die kind of scenario. So that is what we are doing tonight. If you guys have any problems with audio or uh, video quality or if there's any hitch, I think this thing does uh, pop up some ads every now and then. Just uh, blow through those or buy their stuff. I don't really care. But if anything happens, just uh, chat at us. Sitting here, you're watching TV. We can, we can play with the news that way, okay. or which is a little bit too too much. I mm -hmm. think. Or we just have you reading a book, and I brought uh, the Bastia book, the Law. Oh, <laughs> yeah, totally. Because yeah. it's about the law. Um, so you're reading that, and lights the news. It's not like a panic. It's more. It'd be more subtle because we're gonna shoot it about yeah. 120. Yeah, it wouldn't be panic at all. Just like let's go time sort of this. Yeah. So I, mean, I think if we want to play with Chino, he has to leave the scene at some point. Yeah, we can do that. He's sitting next to you. He looks up. 
We can get it and frame it where somebody's over there who has a toy or a treat. Mm -hmm. We can probably try to get it and he jumps. And yeah, I'd, I'd rather not work with animals, but he, if it works out, let's give it a try. If not, we can scratch it right up. There's going to be two stages to the action. Yeah. First stage is as you are, mm -hmm. Gene, stuff you are still carrying. Yeah. So I do have a, a couple of things. Cool. cool. Sitting down and depending on frame is a change. Yeah, lights come in, right? Inside here. So there might be a shot from over here. Which is why we're gonna very couch forward, so more in line with that. Gotcha. So we both lights at the same time, hopefully we'll blow a fuse in that room chamber. Cool. So this is where maybe you get up close. It's either the same shot in close. Yeah. This is your reaction where it's like the knock is coming. It's either you're gonna go with them and maybe live. A state of servitude and slavery, or you resist now. Or maybe you've got some good alternative to the tunnel back. So you just got some C4 to the center. Since this is a door, yeah. you play it like that's your front door. So we'll shoot a separate component at a different time with like a SWAT team. So yeah, it's, it's, not, like, it's not like a no knock. Yeah. They are going to, they're ready to take it. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, they come quietly. They're stacked up. They're ready to go. So we'll yeah. play that some more time. Probably even going to. That might be your trailer material to cut it all together. It could work. Yeah. It would be really, actually really good. You can just store the trailer for the device. Yeah. Cool. So, yep. this plate in close, uh, and you stand up to face the lights. This is the hero shot that I want. It's going to be yep. about ass level. We're going to play it. We're going to shoot about 120 or 60. So, yeah, it's real slow motion. This is why I want the, uh, the uh, atmosphere in the room. So, we'll fog up the room a little bit. We'll shoot some lights in and direct them. To it, just like I'll move it fast so it'll play kind of normal. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah. we'll try to get some foreground elements in play, but this is where basically you stand up and face the light, and you go through the piece. Okay. So, 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 so you have the shot where you choose, and then the shot where it's like you see it's like Yeah, so we do it. And this is when we start cutting into like Eric, we have three ways to do it. Oh, totally, yeah, yeah. The three different different. yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, I totally do. So, a macro of um, that slide from forward on around, switching right in, yeah. And then probably I didn't bother drawing anything after this, but uh, this is when you put it back and suddenly you've got your gear. So this is the second stage. Cool. Yeah. And then we're going to cut so to get the drop leg where it's like you're just putting that piece back into your drop leg. Right. And drop it, but that's like, it's probably a nice volume of that. And the whole time I brought some strobes to see what they look like, but I'll, I'll try to play the blue and the red off in a nice way. Kind of play around the room? Yeah. 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 That's all it works? Yeah, man. Um, for the side, what do you think? You want to use yours? Yeah. For the drop leg? Okay. I guess, I guess, well, I don't have to, but I, I do have that brought my own some materials. Well, then let's use yours. I just do have that. And so this one is the one where, same shot basically, but now you're in full gear. Yeah. And um, I had you walk in the way, which is where you go to the outdoors here. We can see the time. Yes. We don't have any aggressive stance in anything. This is just like. The only thing, the, the only thing I would say cool if you want to show that without, we can't get the lot. It's very cheesy to achieve. It's simply just slow. Taking it off. That might be better to see it. You can't go. Yeah, and just taking off safety. I think that says a lot more. Yeah, we'll play it later. Yeah, 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 we can play it out. That's cool. But then the thing about that yeah. is slow motion. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah. yeah, we'll do that. Cool. It's not necessarily cheese because we get into the. Uh, so we'll resist. Because it's more like just standing your ground instead of just right there and swinging from the come down. So this scene will play out for the final little three minutes of this movie. Yeah, no, I think it's great. Yeah, we cut it with, with other stuff that we shoot later. But be, totally, I'm t with my head with Eric, three ways to stand it, boom, 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 that stuff. Yeah. So I can put this away. Yep. What's up, buddy?
works out for insurance. Sixteen viewers, guys. Damn. I think that's uh, sixteen videos. Um, okay, so sixteen very special people. Don't forget to introduce yourself, though, okay? What I might do is push the chair forward again, shoot okay. from behind it, and just use mm. a zoom lens since we get it as a foreground element. Okay. What are you making noise for? <laughs> Scared? No, no, I, no it's, it's more of excitement. Like, Ooh. I just want to create depth. Otherwise, yeah. yeah. We might move some other things around if, if Chino is uh, being settled. I might put it here. Hey. I love them. But I understand. Yeah. Feel free to give them a right hook. A right hook? No! Yeah. I know that I'm going to want to move this table. Where and uh, we'll move that this way. Which way? That way? Follow me. Yeah, yeah. Yes, you actually pulled it here to the Yeah. 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 Y
second sight now. Cool. Alright. <laughs> Great. Teal's gonna be all fallen and then Jason go over and he's gonna be some paper shit. Yeah. Who shot what? Can we see anything cool? Ah, oh, Kamal's watching. Hey, baby! Uh, yeah. But, uh, is he like outside? He says he's outside. like guns anyways these days. Cops will shoot you either way. That's true. Offhand, do you think that any circuits in here could handle two one Ks or one outlet? Only out of one outlet? Why uh not have some court? I guess I could run one I mean it, it could. Yeah, I'd rather handle that. Yeah. Mitch usually handled that stuff. This is as far back as it goes. I do have your 32 big car. Sweet. I You're really right. haven't missed it much. <laughs> I'm not even using it. Now it's supposed to be for man. Basic ground down, we're going to just do camera setup and go with the flow. Well, I'm not even going to do this. This might be more of a behind the scenes. Or if you still can. Yeah. I'm just running off the 700. I'm not over to the run down. Yeah. She said, oh, one of those moments. How's it going, man? I'm Chris. 
Jake. Jake. Hello. Writer director of Little Wolf. Red Hat Productions. Red Hat Productions. Okay, we're still good. Yeah. Do you want to get dressed? Yeah. Or do you want to? I need dress. I'm gonna grip you. I will grip the shit out of you, man. We want. All you gotta do is throw him, throw him some. Ah, dude. Jake. Fuck. Ah. <laughs> he just sucks it up in your kung fu. You know what? If you ignore him, it's a lot better. I know. <laughs> just saying. I, you want me to move that over here? No, I was gonna use it as a stand. Okay. No. No sound. No sound. No sound. You don't need it. Jake! Hello, oh, buddy. Out oh, sound. No sound. Is this everybody? Man? Yeah, this is everybody, man. Okay. I'm about to remember how to use this camera. By the way, butthead. Well. Okay, yeah, I don't, I yeah, we'll just have a I'll explain it for the benefit of our A team viewers now. Ooh, cool. <clears throat> okay, so Chris and Jake, I've been working on a documentary about the police state stuff. So, okay. so this is basically the ending of the uh, final phase of the documentary, right? Sure. We, we basically called out the government as traitors and says they create laws. To make yes, innocent make people, criminals. yeah, uh, it's really crime. But since they pass this new law, now I'm a criminal, okay. and it becomes our sort of view of existing laws, right? Our constitution. So what I wanted to do is illustrate this in tandem with the interview, sort of a dramatized ending, and also double it for possible material for the trailer. So we're gonna have Danny. Yeah, Danny's like hanging out reading the law, possibly, right? Ah! He gets hit with the lights, right? So his house is surrounded by a SWAT team. Right? The lights come in. Uh, we're going to be probably one kick through this window, one kick through that window. So he's lift from both sides. And we'll get some uh, strobe. We'll just see what the strobe is doing. Yeah. yeah, he's not going to panic. He just knows that it's time. Right? But maybe we have Gino here. If it works, we'll see how we get to the lights. Probably not before, right? So he goes to the door. What's he going to do? So we'll shoot this by being close and standing up and facing the lights. Well, we're going to see like, what his decision is going to be. He's going to go for his piece. Okay? He decided he's going to die in his doorway instead of being taken. So. Cut from there and do some macro shots in the chamber. You can still right. It's super pretty. You're really looking close up to the chamber. He's going to put it back, but now he's like fully dressed. He's got a tack vest, he's got the air fatigue. He puts the side into his drop left holster. Chambers they are. And so we're going to repeat the wide shot where he's facing the light. And then we're going to cut this with probably a SWAT team yelling and demanding that he come to the board quietly. I want it to look like. We'll just shoot this one page through the door and see what happens. But I want to pump some smoke through it, get some atmosphere going, hopefully, get like a slatted light to the right sort of in the middle there. And I want to expose for the highlights possible so everything else kind of falls off. We'll just we'll see what we get. Mostly it's about, I think it should be a gangster movie. Yeah, it's really, I'm lagging, 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 yeah. That's really easy. Um, I'm worried about the electricity, so let's get on top of that. Let's try to run wires to every, like, farthest out. Yeah, yeah, and there's, we got outlets in the kitchen, too. And then the one cage, two, two mm -hmm. one cage outside. Yeah. We have the smoke machine, which we'll unplug whenever we're not using it. Yeah. We'll try to, like, try to toggle the lights. <laughs> I just don't want to pop it to use it. Yes. That's the whole thing for another though. And this house. So this this light back here will provide a rim for Danny. Right? As he's sitting. Yeah. This one will provide a key. I brought a couple. Can we bring those uh, reflector boards? Yeah. Yep, yep, they're right over there. Okay, we'll play with those if we need them. Otherwise, we'll yeah. be moving around with those little strobes. I'll show them to you now. I think that the red is a little bit darker, so I got a bigger strobe for it. These also require, they're not battery powered. 
I have three of them, so if we want a white one going as well, we can do that. But these strobes, basically it goes like off, tick, 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 as you go farther up the dial. So that's how that works. <clears throat> and I know we're going to get that nasty uh, rolling shutter effect. We'll try to mitigate that. Maybe I'll, maybe we, how low does the uh, shutter speed go on the 700? One frame a second. One? Yeah. Shutter? Oh, shutter, sorry. Um, it, uh, it has a full range like that because it has a still camera mode too, so it opens still camera. I, would, I wouldn't go lower than 30. <laughs> Well, yeah, you're going to get blurry, anything under yeah. 50. Yeah. But that might mitigate the problem shutter effect. Oh, yeah. We can go lower. We'll, I mean, we'll try it. It's a little bit of experimentation. I'll need you to remind me how to work So let's start off with um, give a variable exposure of lens. So let's see your lab chart. What's, what, what is it? It's like a 5.6, 3.5, 5.6. Five, five, oh, I don't know. Uh, what lens do you want me to put this on? Is it a, is it, I'm using an FS100 on this image shoot. It's always reversed from the Canon, like focus. And yeah, I never use Canons. And, uh, I'm kind of angling out for using my lenses. I know that I haven't adapted. So I'll try to work with that. Just so. Okay, so here's the light kit. Bust out. My stands are really shitty, so just uh, don't go too high or too wobbly with them. Obviously, it's going on in there. There's two 1Ks to get them set up outside. There's down an outlet out there, so we have one on that outlet and run a stinger into the kitchen, I would say, for the other one. I just realized one of my uh, SD cards is cracked, so I have to get some, you know? We shouldn't be shooting that much. Yeah, that's fine. So you want to show the speed of food? Let's try it. Oh, look. What is the damn thing? It's a bonus Oh, jeez. Oh, this thing I'll put over here. Yeah. Yep. Yep. And if we want to blow them out with some umbrellas, kind of even bigger, uh, we got we have at least one. Yeah. I'm just gonna start with my wide. Danny, I've never been over to this masterpiece. Of the masterpiece. Really? Oh yeah. You know, like the spiral staircase. The, the, the love spiral. The other are straight, you know, are like 50 feet in the month. It's actually 100. But Whatever. Hey guys, is that fan noise bothering you? I'll go ahead and shut it off. We're all going to suffer in here. Uh, so what was the deal last time we were doing with this? It was like uh, not allowing us to change apertures unless we switched over to a can for a second, right? I can't communicate with that with okay. the lens. So uh, you might have to use my mini filter or else we'll just do shuttered frame rate and see what happens. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think we'll probably just use this lens. I know that's what I usually use. <laughs> Did you say something? What? Did you say something? You need something? Yeah, I guess we got a light in the house. Should be good after that. Okay. There's only a couple shots that we need to get, but yeah. if you knock them down, they look like a bolt. Use 
this in a mini mold for anything? We'll see. Do uh, these fit onto the one case? Bungalows? I hope so. Uh, I hope so. I don't need them. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, I like that. Do you want to run one of these from the kitchen? Yeah, I'm trying to I mean, you probably run it. for now, Chris. You can go ahead and kill it, though. Go ahead, Chris. What? Is this just a... Uh, well, hopefully this will throw some shadow in there. Okay, so my idea is that uh, you're reading by sunlight, right? Yeah, so yeah. So more favorite lighting for your fill is going to be a lamp. Right about here. And so I have this in here as well. That one. Any gels? So you want to do the lamp over yes. here? Yes. Uh, Singers, you found gels are. What do you mean gels are today? Cool. Did you do that. So, Danny, that being said, I might need a couple of the regular gels. Right. You want to go with like a street light package for that? Uh, what is that outside? No. It is a. Uh, Reserve. Oh, okay. Okay. So blue or red? Just white. Just a white. I have two strokes there to serve the uh, flashing light. Oh, yeah. I don't see the plug in here. No. They may need to run one. What do you tell um, Danny? Yo, you know where the fuse box is? It's going to be downstairs. You know if you've seen it? Nope. I've not actually seen it. Can you do me a big, warm, solid, and go look at it, and just see if you can, if it's even written on there, how many circuits you have how many circuits? in your unit. It should be kitchen, living room, maybe upstairs. If there's an upstairs one, I want to run something down there. Cool. Yeah. Just to be safe. Then come back and get dressed. Oh, yeah. I love this bar. Hey guys, is that a uh, fan noise still on? Because I shut the fan off. Dude, you're a magician. How did you do this? I don't Come to grip. Oh. Okay. 
how it looks like in the end. Okay, you can run that one now. Wrong times. Nothing at all. 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 Nothing at Okay, and uh, Jake, Chris, Chris, I'm not really, uh, I'm not gonna bother you honestly. Really. There's an outlet right here for the smoke machine. <laughs> the smoke machine, well I don't want everything plugged in at once. Tell me what you need me to do, man. I just okay. want to make sure that one of these lights is running off the, uh, running off the kitchen circuit set up for it. Yeah. But uh, guys, both, both watch here. You know, operate, operate. Yeah, you shouldn't have to look. You turn it on. This thing on. I have it set up so it basically comes with the IPs. Let it focus. Okay. Yeah. That should do auto focus. Okay. Yeah. 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 Did you, did you go look? I was confused, like... Okay, Jake. Our backup if the strobes just aren't working is we're going to set up another couple lights out here. Cool. And you weren't there for our Christmas shoot. You can't be more Gina! Hey! Gina! <laughs> um, we're going to set up a couple lights. It's uh, what? I only find one here, so I have some skis. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Over here. Hey, I'll have a whiskey cup. Let's get a whiskey cup. Oh, so <laughs> it's going to make it a lot easier. Let's get like a backpack battery set up around shit like this. But I do have a um, splitter. I have boots. I have boots. I have boots. So find that there's a three way splitter in here. Uh, it shouldn't. It won't take up much electricity at all. But uh, I want all three of these strobes plugged into a splitter running on a mobile cable that will just move around. But it'll, it'll be over there somewhere. Probably outside. Okay. Did you look? Did you move my shoes? I remember doing that. You chill. You eat my fucking boots, man. All I got is power strip. That work. It works. I know I threw a splitter. Maybe I didn't. Uh, yeah, remember the wrong thing. It is going to be. Just checking there. We can use a power strip if you can't find it. Fifteen viewers, huh? People are just just leaving, dropping my flies. The battery's going to be okay. It's running it constantly. Mm -hmm. Orange. Okay, I'm going to attempt to remember. Let's see. As long as you get a nice and extension. Shutter speed. Oh, it's opening up. This guy? Is this what you got? That's short. No, I, I, don't, I don't think there's a sweater in here. No, just use this. It's cool. <gasps> Maybe I put it in my backpack. Yeah. Ah. This one? Green one? Yeah. That'd be in the front pouch. There might be a gun in there or something. So. <laughs> <laughs> There Oops. might be a Dude, Mr. Crawley. I got a... What's, what's the native ISO on this? Um, 500. So, yeah, 500. I want one. <laughs> I'll switch it to 500. If you I think I see a flash. No, no. I just want to... The old one is okay. some kind of... 3200 is good if you shoot. Yeah, I don't usually go about that. Oh, yeah. Do I should have stuff to keep with 3200. Okay. Then, then I won't worry about it. Okay. Look at that stuff. Oh, yeah. Wait, there's some bullets. Yes, there's some bullets. <laughs> oh, you mean candy? I need this too. Well, alright, oh god. Went downstairs to see if I can find a few spots then. Okay, Dan, thank you. Cool. Dan makes I sense. I definitely believe that there's a splitter somewhere. 
you should do if you have to. It's a small problem. It's all right. Okay, my next problem. So he's going to be sitting here, presumably reading the book. I might option the TV dinner instead. But uh, you know, motivated yes. lighting here. Right. It's on this. It's on You might have a I need something to run in here with another square of so both of these lights. Okay. And I'm going to unplug that 1K and try this one. Yeah. All right. I suppose you need both of those, Dylan. What? Those black ones. What are you pointing to? Uh, that was right on the back. Oh. I do not know. I told Dan to unplug everything in the house, pretty much. Oh, this is scary. Not bad. Not bad. He's puzzled, buddy. He's puzzled, guy. Oh, that's not bad. So, uh, for the most part, each of your circuits is not standard. Two Ks, you can handle one point five. So a one K is fine on it, but not two. No, not two. Okay. So we can we can double up like the smoke machine. You think? Yep. The smoke up. machine should be fine. Yeah. How many amps is it? I don't know. Uh, since we lost Mitch, this is all like it's all Mitch's side. Side. I wonder if Mitch is watching. What is that plugged into there? Right? <laughs> uh, oh, Mitch is watching and laughing. We're like, oh, that okay. first pack looks great in the Hawaiian shirt. Okay. Right. Um, no, we run that to the kitchen instead. Yeah. You know who looks good in a wine shirt? Amy Mason. Playing Chris Pepp. Hello! Is it me? It's just going. It's just going now? Do that again. No, it's going to work. No. Yeah. Good. Stop. 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 Lights, Danny. Where are you? You don't find those on the one those on the one Ks out there? Yes. yes. You want me to fire them up? I want you to right. turn Danny, go in here, please. Yeah. I need these house lights turned off. Yeah. Jake is still doing that thing. I need a I gotta use a longer one. This thing's too short. Yeah. Damn! <laughs> it does look like a horror film. Oh shit! That's a lot brighter than I imagined. Alright, okay. Let's see now. God damn. That is way better. That's gonna, this is going to be really cool. Feels kind of fucked up. Okay, go ahead and kill those 1Ks. That'll work. Let's just keep, uh, let's keep working here. Chris. Okay, house lights back on, please. Yeah. House lights. Don't. Give me a second. Give me a second. That's just like, it might be different. 
whatever you got to do. Yeah. That's all. Get in there and introduce yourself and say hello. Yeah. Oh, I will. Once I get ready to go. Gina, what are you doing, man? Gina, I gotta go smoke that weed. <laughs> Quit smoking the weed, dude. So you, you did call the police, right? Oh, yeah. Which is really funny. They're like, so you're just calling to let me know that you're shooting and filming around while it's on your deck. Yeah, that's it, man. That's it. Anything else? No? No, we're good. That's it. Alright. As long as they know. You know. I mean, now we've got smoke going out the door. So. Yeah. Yep. Um, yeah. Can you tell me where the house lights that are? Just there's a light switch right there and the other side right over there. Yep, right here. And on the other side. Right, right here. Okay, now I've learned. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah, sit down. Cool. Yeah. Get over here. Oh my, that's gorgeous. You gotta read some law, dude. Apparently David uh, highlights some important things. <laughs> okay, Chris, show me some. Uh, where you had it a second ago was better. Right here? Yeah, okay, because what I'm seeing. Okay. Oh, there we go. See what he's doing here? I, I don't know if you can see it, but he is Does throwing the triangle or anything. Damn, you look awesome. Damn, bro. Yeah, that's good. We'll, we'll go with that for now. Oh, he just wants a little love. Yeah, he's just wants a little love to uh, some dudes. He's like, look at the boots. So, uh, let me turn on this halo light right here. Uh, Jake's working on it. Okay. Oh, I'm I'm not, I might not even do that. He's just reading the book. Yeah, he's not fucking good. Little, little nice triangle of light on the yeah, yeah, that's what, that's what I'm going for, but that's in the ground up. Why should we not organize the labor, construction, and religion? Yeah, can you, uh, right. why? Zanny, yo, show me standing up and facing the light. Door would be close, right? Yeah. Okay, we are getting that latticework screen that I wanted, which is pretty sweet. There's plenty of atmosphere in the room. Yeah. So I'll probably run a couple different variations and with different stages of smoke, right? What I don't like is how the streamers are mostly like straight on once in a while. But then again, it is a pretty star. So, uh, why don't you try dropping it together? Can you drop it a little bit lower? Yeah, yeah, like it would be like here if it was a big star. Like, yeah, this one. It would be so high up. It would be like a, this truck. It would be like the SWAT truck. Go on, Okay, come on. I brought you a watch? Yeah. This is tactical. It's broken. This is tactical. It's broken as shit, though. Yeah. Say how many dollars. Watch this side. Okay, this thing. Inside the pants, this goes around the belt. You have a belt? Yeah, that's belt. Can you see it? Let's work on that. You're going to want it to be like with the, with the knob jab. of your hip, right? right? That, that end flap kind of goes over that, and the rest is good. First yeah, I think this is hidden. I don't think so. Gino, move. Sit down. Yeah, that's. Hmm. Well, you can go sit and do that, right? Or stand over there somewhere? Yeah, I'll stand over there. I'm kind of liking where it was, even though that's a little bit more realistic. Yeah. And move it this way a little bit because when he stands up, he's got to like be like right in it. Cool. Well, this is coming along really well. Here's this guy. And yo. Can you check out those night sights here? Yeah. Does this really do anything? It will. Once that 1K shot off, we're, we're kind of working on that light now. Is this, is this one on? Green light thing? Motivated lighting. I'm sure. Yeah, I'll give this to that. Jake, if that light gets drowned out, it does not really matter. Because I want something for that half second before we hit these big lights. Okay, what's that top light doing on above you? I don't know. Let me turn that on. How do you. Is the switch right, right next to you, Jake, to the right? There you go. Pop it. There you go. Pop off. That's really pretty, Mr. Peck. I like that. Oh, Danny, sit down. Ooh. What? I'm sweating. I'm sweating. That's all right. <laughs> hey, Danny, put down the book, stand up, face the door. That's nice. That's nice. I will repo for that one, and we'll uh, probably change the lights up Yeah. at that time. Um, <clears throat> okay, what I want to do now is, uh, how are these strobes coming? Did we give up on that? 
No, we didn't try yet. No, I don't think so, not yet. Do we have other power to service? I know we just put it in the Red one, and there's a blue one plug on somewhere. Is that going to get that happening? That's going to start outside, but I want to refill it as we uh, go into close to this. Hey, Danny. Yo. Oh, <laughs> fool. Do you? I was just looking here. Oh, right. Is that it? Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Okay. What I'm. If what only I want. you got a gun. Is uh. <laughs> what did you just say? I said if only you got a gun. Let me let me direct my talents. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I don't. Stand up. Face yep. the door. And just. I just want to see the pinky hook the shirt and expose the butt of the, the gun, right? Yeah. We'll go for the, the whole draw, but I'll probably do that at some point. Yeah, it's all good. Totally. Macro. You just want to see that, though, right here, right? Yeah. Look at the camera? Yep. So why don't you show me that? Yeah. So right here, David? You're going to be over by the couch. Yep. Fool. Well, fool? There's a, there's a peck here, man. <laughs> He's like, oh, oh nice. Nice. peck. Yeah. Anybody will. What are you going to do when Chris Peck comes knocking? You're looking at it. Step closer where you were sitting in the middle of the couch. Yeah, we're, we're, we will move the table. Yeah. Okay, ready? Looking? Yeah. Oh, cool. <laughs> Who's moving that door? Is that that looks pretty sweet. Nobody? That looks pretty sweet. <laughs> we might want to like do that some more. Uh, yeah, that'll work, though. Look Stay there. It? Yeah. Is there an artificial zoom to check uh, focus? Yes, there is. Today? Expand his focus. Oh, so, um, you right here the Jesus. Right here, right? Yeah. I don't. Danny, stay still. Stay still. amazing. Whatever aperture I have, this side is working for me. Yeah, it should be pretty good. It's at what, five, six right now. Get out of there. Is he really doing what I think he's doing over there? Who? What? Right behind you. Pouting? Yeah, see no pouting right there? Aw, That's okay. Who was a clue? I don't actually like the peeking. Oh, that looks nice. It looks mm -hmm. sexy. You might want to. We have some good screenshots here. Screenshots? How you doing? How you doing? Look at me. <laughs> Come here, boy. <laughs> That's it. Beautiful. <laughs> he is powerful. He's totally powerful. He's totally powerful. He's totally powerful. He is totally powerful. Yeah, he's a 50. Are you showing him your ass? Shh. Are you trying to fart? No. Well, I was trying to fart it would. Okay, so, um, yeah. Can I shoot 120? Yeah, can I shoot 120 consistently? That's a star trigger in my hand. Mm. But then again, yeah. what does it say your number of people? Oh, 17 viewers. Top right on. 17 viewers? 17. Well, it's got to be more than that. I have so, total of five on mine. Yeah, enjoying it. Spock. Do you want the top handle for this, David? No, I shouldn't need it. No, I don't think so. Yeah. 970, no, why do we keep getting new fans? It's, it's strange. We haven't had any new fans for months. That's, that's a good thing. Let's not question it. Okay. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, move, move for a second. Yep. Oh, those aren't going to do anything. No. Not, not at least that 1K. Are you even serious? No. I know. Oh, he sees a guy holding two strobes. If you were to put him, like, in the back window, maybe, but... There's going to be another one. Yeah. You make it mm -hmm. yeah, end trigger. Oh, end trigger for slow mo. So, yeah. so what if these started first? Because without this up, like I can see it here. Yeah. 
Say what? No. Oh, no, that light is on. Yeah. So what I'm wondering is, because the best way these would show up is that, but honestly, if this thing was off, it would turn it on. Yeah. Like cherries and berries. Is this yeah. going to show up? No, it's not powerful. It, it might work for the close-ups. Which I'm fine with. Do you want to on end trigger or end trigger half? End trigger. Okay. One point. Okay. I'm going to test that. Not one point. Kind of sixty. So imagine. Okay. I didn't touch the frame rate yet. So. I okay. okay. I'm going to throw on the end. Not the frame rate. This is the shutter speed. Okay. Yeah, I, didn't do that. I think it's probably automatically. Uh, what you do you use? No, it's not. It's not. No, I change it all the time. Um, Ooh. Where did you put it? That's what she said. She didn't say that. God damn it! Yes, she did. So well, she might have said that. Actually. She, she, she. I'm pretty sure she, she did. Have said that. You so, know, what? I think, I think I heard you say that. I think she did say I, that. I think she did. But David, but seriously, you just press the shutter button on the side, and then you can change okay. whatever degree you want it. But you know, 180 is the standard. After 180, no. I keep How about 192. Is that? That's just gonna be. Yeah, Danny, go sit. Cool. Okay, Jake, let's close that door. Oh. Okay, hold on, hold on. You want to hit smoke? I want you to. No, no, I don't no. really care about smoke right now. Um, maybe a little. No. No, I'll do it. Right now. <laughs> Throw on that other 1K, shut the door, and stand by on the strobes and just bring them up to the window. Oh, I got shutter speed, so. Bad. That's. Sorry, that's shutter speed. Angle. Is that ang angle or speed? speed? So that's that's normal. Should I get on the couch? Should I get on the couch? Come here. Can you get on the couch? Come here. Yeah. 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 <laughs> well, it is. Look at the shot. Woo! I'm dog. You're the best dog. He loves that dog. Made some money today. Did you? Who did you, uh, you dance for? Yeah. You got a big piece. Of Stripping for a little wolf. It, it. That's great. You want me to take down the piece poster? What, the yin yang? No. That's oh. a, you put a great state poster up. It's the next super fiddle girl. That'd be really good for the time lapse. Oh. That is confusing. I got a great idea for posters. <laughs> <laughs> Some dirt tape on it. The film that little I've heard of. But not enough of. Look at this guy. He is such a handsome dog. I mean that. Talk about you, buddy. Do you know how to middleman? Radimus? Awesomeness? Why? Do you know Awesomeness? Mesa? No, I believe it's Maximus Awesomeness. That's stupid. <laughs> um, the light kick can be moved over here. I'm just going to do that comment. Ratchet's for that. Can I take the lens off of my CD? Yeah, it's fine. I'm just going to check the aperture.
Are you learning over there? It is for the reader to pass it as a question. Now it's the purpose of the of this track. What are the strangest things I've ever done? See, if, I'm, if they yeah. kill, but he has to be able to kill those at the same time, wouldn't he? Maybe. I don't think it's possible. I don't, I don't care. Nothing is impossible, right? Mm -hmm. We can you know, take one of those cords and then uh, just hit both at the same time if you just yank them. Mm -hmm. I think you might have to turn them on at the same time. Is that what we're talking about? Yeah, what I'm saying is he could yank yeah, them. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. Flappies. Flappies. Okay. I'm going to get a little bit more smoke now. <laughs> I'm crushing pretty hard over here, guys. Nice. <laughs> Can you uh, turn that off? Yeah. I unplugged it. I was going to say, because I didn't do that. That wouldn't be very well. That wouldn't be. Hey, Jake, you're fired. Okay. <laughs> How many times does he have to tell you? I don't even work here. Dude, I don't even work. The last time, where's my frappuccino, damn it? No, you keep doing it. Did he may help myself to a glass of water? Yes, you may. Yes. Yes, yeah, you may sign it. Super black lecture. Oh, you, you, you go down if you want to. That'd be cool if the dog was trained so you could secretly tell if it started going back. Like the lights train. Are you assuming that my dog's not trained? No, he's trained. I mean, if you, you, you call my dog an idiot, is that smart enough to be trained? Are you, are you insulting me here? See, now you're going to say, like, he's going to. Oh. <laughs> there it goes. What was that? What was that? What is that? You know, <laughs> he does not like it. It's okay. It's okay. Just a smoke machine. What is that? What do I do? I don't think they're going to be able to do that. I would rather not worry about it. Wow, you have a very job. Is that that would be a... Blankets? <clears throat> yep. All right. Yeah. This one doesn't look like your bed. <laughs> oh, I just will sleep here. Okay. Tell Jake to turn on the uh, 1K there. Turn on the 1K. Gino. Gino. Get off. I just had a fright. It's hurting. Good. Okay, Chris. Can you go off on that light over there? The reading light. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. What? What? Oh. Can I read the light off? Yes, please. Just now. Oh. You full? And the one behind it. You alright? Okay, Danny, show me a standing up. Yep. Into danger. Go for your piece. Oh, that'll work. That'll work real well. Cool. Okay, Chris, turn that light on. Is that practical? No. Okay. Okay, off. Is it a big problem? Please show me off and on. Now nah, we're going off. <laughs> well, that's worth a try. Okay. Hey, those strobes, are they out there? Hey, you got those strobes? Put the scrolls on. Thank you. Not in the slightest. Okay. Good. Okay, well, this would be a million different things. I won't worry about the red and blue lights when the other lights are coming. You know why? Because it's really easy to put it back on. 
Yeah. That's what's happening. Yeah, that's not good. That's not sad. So bring them in and keep them like Maybe, uh, my only idea was behind the camera. Well, yeah, my only idea was if they had the sauce, they made it to the sauce. Yeah, why don't you show that to me? I'll yeah. so turn those lights off and we'll try that. You cool? Can I hook you up uh, some way where you can turn them on at the same time? Oh, the lights? Yeah. That'd be pretty slick. Yeah. Well, but they're hooked up separate, though, right? Yeah. Uh, well, we have two people who yeah. can do it, yeah, so it would just be a cue and then go. Uh, yeah, kill those lights and show I me the... this is going to work. It might, but I don't know. <laughs> no. Probably goofy, huh? No. I can't even see that. No. Nope. Well, let me try again. It's like you can see it out here. Can't see I can kind of see it now. <laughs> I can't see anything else. I know, I know. That's what I mean. You can see it in the dark. Let's see, we had some bright ones. It looks like he's like he's going to be abducted. And like big white lights hit it. And then, like, you know, well, well if you have that lamp light on behind him, maybe. This makes sense, right? Oh, God. He had his reading light on. Well, I want the bright light. Yeah, why don't we do both? But I think as a sequel. I'm guessing it doesn't work very well. If you hold it completely still, you can do both. <laughs> okay, what we'll do is we'll just play it in super, super close. Yeah? Okay. That kind of thing. So we need macros, then we'll bring in those lights. Yeah, that works. Okay. So, uh, Jake, that's a lot of fun. Jake, techno. I yeah, kill those and bring them inside. Keep them behind the camera. Cool. And uh, let's get some house lights back on and get ready to roll. Go for house lights. Yeah, you can do that. There we go. Jake, just the house lights, unless you yeah, unless you need that right now. Okay, so shutter is 192. You have a dump a card reader? No, but you have a Mac that looks like. I don't think I got it. Yeah, right here on the side. SD. SD works there? Yeah, right there. SD slot. No way. Yeah. No way. Yeah, we <laughs> nice. Okay, let's close the door so we can retain the smoke. Yeah. <clears throat> so does Chino need to go upstairs or something? Or is that going to wake him up? Oh, uh, no, that's okay. He should be fine. I'll just sit over here. Okay, so we're going without the... Yeah, uh, we'll try it once or twice, but if he starts getting weird, then I'll just put him upstairs. Okay. Just do that. He's you feel that, dude? You guys stay over here. So we're going about the practical first run. Shooting on 20, so it'll be a fast slider move. Yep, and just it'll, it'll be a, like this an action and basically a one count, and then the lights. Action. And then you just do the action, bam, and then you're responding Action, one lights. click. Put the book down. If you want to just kind of like, uh, what's the buffer time for 120? Like, uh, it's all like It's seconds. nine seconds, I think. So we have nine seconds. Here, let's just check it out. Yeah. So Done. each shot is going to be nine seconds. That's that's how much time you have. It's cool. Okay. But I, uh, you could you could go normally because we can slow it down as long as we need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Twenty is pretty slow. Yeah. Maybe. So like this. Simple we'll, enough. We'll, like, we'll slow way down. Simple enough. Now. Yeah. Okay. And turn. And I, what I like about I like how you kind of lay with your left and your back with your right. You kind of show it off. Yeah. yeah. And pinky loop. Yep. On the shirt. Oh, sure. Just pick it up. And uh, you go for the draw, and we're going to cut at that point. Actually, you go for the draw, it's going to be a straight up, and then straight up. Yeah. Cool. Do you want me to try to put these lights on the splitter? So you just. No, I think Pets can be out there. Yeah, I think you guys are both. Yeah. Well, actually, let's, yeah, let's try. Uh, let's that say action, 
and of one count. Action, <coughs> one, bam. Maybe two. Action, one, bam. <coughs> I'll probably just time up the whole. Okay. Okay, good friends. Just remember, if you hit anything in this freaking camera, it'll switch from slow motion to regular. I didn't have that problem before, I guess I... I probably won't be jamming buttons. Ghost. Yeah, I could use some nice strobes. That would be sweet. Oh, is Ghost from Oklahoma on there? Ghost is from L.A. Oh. Who did we play with? He's got his crew with him. Hey, guys. What? Oh, no. That's a different Ghost. Okay, that was, like, that was a Ghost. Okay. Yeah, you were yeah. there. Did you just run some tests? Yeah, I just run some, some tests. tests of darkness. Yeah. You check your hair. No, it's taking a piss. <laughs> Good. Yeah. Oh. What? We want the whole bar coming. Oh, All right, let's uh, let's yeah, try it. Yeah. Yeah. Gino. Actually, I don't know what the smoke is doing, so we try the practical. Yeah. Hey, Chris, you want to take a position out by the other light? Yeah. One second. I was just doing format. I think that's unplugged. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. So I want to see a little bit. Gino, come on. Come on, buddy. See if you're respecting enough to listen. Oh, you cover up his bed. Jeez. Oh, no, his bed's right there. Oh, okay. Gino, that. Come on, buddy. Yeah. Complete it. What's that? Here's your format. Okay. Down. Be down. Go down. Go down. Go down. Stay. Stay. Stay, boy. Okay. If it's not bugging anyone, I'll keep the uh, practical on and we'll try it from here. You want to turn the house lights? Yes. And trigger. Oh, this is exciting. We are rolling our first shot for those of you watching. Okay, here we go. Stand by. Action. Cool. Cut. Oh. <laughs> You're like, what? You got scared when David said action. Yeah, can, can, he can't go anywhere else. Do you know? Yeah, thank you. Seriously, what is that kind of bring him out? I don't want to like disrupt the family cycle. Or anything. He'll probably be like, why the fuck am I going to like rip up your pack? He'll punish you though. Yeah, he will. He'll okay, kill the lights. Kill the lights. Intriguing. Okay. Yeah, let's try it again. Yeah, let's put Chino away. It was pretty cool how he responded though. Oh, dude, right? Um, Why don't we keep, let's just keep them like that. I think we can insist. No, I agree. Two seconds to do it. Oh, no, no. Hey, guys. Yeah, it's going to be a little kind of a mess. That's really mess of shooting. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to smoke a little bit. It should be puffing here in a little bit. I'm going to plug it in for a few yeah. because it smells pretty good. Um, reaction time for us good? Anything you want to change? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. What yeah. um, I thought was, yeah. Yeah. Because it is 
just move slow motion, right? Yes. Yeah. So okay. what I thought was a, a little bit more of a reaction, because remember, you're probably going to die tonight. Yeah. Wow. Well, this is the thing that I was saying. He's kind of expecting it, right? There's a difference. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're not surprised by yeah. it. You're just like, so there's a, there's, what I saw was like this. Like, you're waiting. Mm -hmm. And what I want more of is like a... Cool. Okay. Yeah, it's a little... Think, think exhale. Yeah. So, okay, so are we... And then, um, you be cool if I actually do a draw, though? Yeah, yeah, your draw was good. Yeah, it was really good. So we'll go all the way up until that point. Cool, man. All right. I messed up because the camera was really slow motion that time. Yeah. Oh, you're looking for that. Do you want me to kill this backlight? I can get up. Yep. Cool. So what about this kitchen one? Is that always on? Yeah, it was always on. We can turn it off if we wanted to. No, no, no. It's right here. Yeah. 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 Off to you. Off to you. Okay, it's a little bit too heavy. So, okay. then let's just open the door. It's not. Off Oh, shit, man. It's full moon tonight. Oh, shit. Process, you know what I mean? Yeah. 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 All right. We good? Yeah. You dust heavy. How long does a walk does it take? They're probably out there now, right? We will probably have to show that. Mm -hmm. yeah. Hey, Jane, can you hit your light, your light only? It's, it's good, it's just uh, I see too much of the tendrils still, you know? No, I shut the door. No, maybe open for just a little bit. And keep the light on. Okay, yeah, now, now shut the door. We roll? Yeah, we'll try one. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, stand by! It's uh, it's going. Yeah. Can we see? Uh, you can watch it. Yeah, that's something you can play that. I'll start that one. That'll work. Yes, let's knock out one more, and then we'll change the angle. Yeah, yeah, that totally. Works. Yeah, it totally does. Okay, this time, this time, instead of coming up into this. Extend it. Extend no, it. I, I don't plan on using it, but just in case. Yep. Poor variation. Yeah. Okay, guys, kill him. Okay, here we go. Stand by. And cut! Okay, it's buffering. Yeah. It's looking good though, I assume. Yeah, that'll, that'll work. It's looking right along with time. 9, 19. That's not bad. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. We're for our shoots, right? Well, I wish the strobes were working, but uh. Yeah, I, I want to get this action in the close anyway. So <laughs> let's go. Yeah, that, that, it does look good, though. Yeah. So I'm pumping this in. Yeah. Our viewers will get a nice shot of the camera for this one. Okay, keep the lights on. Danny, sit down, please. Yeah. This is our 
here in England. Right. Same process? Same process. Oh, it's still the boss right here. Okay, guys, this camera is the Sony FS700. We are shooting at 120 frames per second. So when you see the final product, it's going to have that real dreamlike slow motion. And that's what we're going for tonight. It makes Danny Mason more dreamy. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're ready to go. So, uh, stay still. Focus here. Oh, this is, this is my camera. This is it. Get used to it. You want to cut the lights? One second. Check my screen. Okay, can you just run through the action one bit? Yeah. Okay, so, yeah, I just want, I want to do a follow on this one. Okay, never mind. I will not do the follow. I will do a hero shot later on. So, I'll uh, go and sit down. All right, here we go. Kill the lights. Stand by. Okay, here we go. Action. And cut. Okay, I'm going to move those that one. Yes. Move your right along. <laughs> you can totally see, like, next time, flip it the other way so the cover lands so I can, like, read it. Wait, hold on, let me see. Because I can read it, but it's that way, but it, oh, really? it, it curls up this way, right? Oh, okay. So, okay. Like yeah. so like this. Yeah, yeah, yeah so it's facing it. me. Not, not straight on, but, like, this way. This way? Like this, yep. I don't, I don't want you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Try that. Yeah. <clears throat> Check and focus. Yeah. Alright. Alright. Alright, precious. You see this? Keep in great state. You alright? Yeah. Okay, we'll do a follow this time. So, <clears throat> let's run through it again. Same motion. Alright, here we go. Kill the lights. Kill the lights! Here we go! Action! Cut! Yeah, let me show you what it's thinking for the draw. It's yeah, fine. it's been fine, but uh. More of a steady draw. Okay. Like, he's not reacting to anything, like motion or anything. It's just, okay. so it's more just right. okay. Okay. Like this. Yeah. yeah. Okay, I'm gonna smoke it a little bit. Yeah. Mm So like the carries and die out. <clears throat> Okay, well, we wait for the smoke to dissipate here. I'll answer your questions. Danny is reading The Law by Frederic Bastiat, which is appropriate for the scene, I believe. Um, we will be streaming the other scenes if we can. Yeah, he's not reading the TV guide.
<laughs> okay, Jake, show me the light. Thank you. All right, kill it. Actually, turn it back on, Danny, stand up. Okay, kill the light. Here we go. Stand by. Action. Okay, reset. Here we go. Action. Okay, Jay, keep your actually keep your lights on, Daniel Stander. Yeah. Lights on, lights on, lights on. Bedtime, Danny? I don't really have one. Okay. Well, what's yours? Oh, when, when are we going to start pissing people off and whatever? Oh, uh, like my roommate and stuff? Uh, well, when do you want to stop? Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Yeah, you guys should probably read this uh, read this book. It's amazing. Yeah. Okay, show me uh, your hand on the camera. Yeah, we'll start from the uh, the beginning. Wow, that is not concealed at all. I know, right? Okay, kill the lights. Here we go. Action. Okay, that's too much of a. Yeah, I'll I'll take it, but uh, that was too much of a. Rotation. Too much rotation. Okay. So we'll keep, it. we'll keep the lights on for the book. Stand up and just rotate just a quarter turn back. Oh, right right there. there. Yeah, right there should be fine. Cool. We go from there. Nice. Nice. Slow. You can just keep it from standing up. Okay. Okay. Cut. Pull, pull your shirt down. Good. And guy, two new gears. <laughs> If you want me to draw. Yes. Okay, here we go. Action. That was pretty cool. Okay, that was pretty cool. 
Okay, so what I'm going to do now is set up for the hero shot, which I think would be better managed this time. Yeah. So I'm taking it off sticks. And we'll frog up the room a little bit. I think you're about to be reactions if you want. Yeah. Actually, I would like to get a nice close up of that. You know? Yeah, I would watch it. Kill the light. Okay, I'm going to go back here. Yeah. Bring it. Bring it, sucker. Bring it, bitch. We ain't playing, sucker. Okay. Got it. And damn. It's really sexy, man. Just stand there with your. And a, Jake, light! Okay, and I forgot to set my aperture. Okay, you show me your posture there. Stay still. Still learning all the buttons. Okay. All right, this is just for. Can you knock down that that uh, big board behind you? Just you, stand by. Yeah. Action. Hold on, reset, reset. Yeah, you know, I had a tough time following your action. Yeah. Here we go, action. Okay, uh, that's not gonna work. Uh, just slow it down for me. Yeah. And I want you to turn into that light that's behind you a little bit more. I know I told you not to do it, but yeah, right there. Cool. Okay. Here we go. Oh, Chris, turn your light on. Hey, Danny. Yeah. Um, what I don't want to see this time yeah. is you're pulling too gently, so it's tugging your pants. Yeah. So go slow, but then one quick jerk, yeah. right? Yeah, you're a jerk. Okay, show me your motion there. Hip rotation here. 
Here? It's right there. Is that what, can you hit that mark every time? No, do no dust. Okay, right there, because yeah. that's where I'm going to get you. Okay, here we go. Action. Okay, I'm taking it. <clears throat> no. Okay, now I'm going to take it from the beginning. I didn't get your close up. Yeah. So I'll do that. Yeah. I'll that right now. So, wherever you were on the couch before, I'll have to move that light again. Maybe. This is just you. So, let's try to your face. I will follow you and see what happens. Yeah. But this is where I want to see most of the eyes, right? Yeah. So, let the light hit you for a half second before you look up to it. Yeah. It's like this bang. Stand up and turn to it. Yeah. Hmm. Here we go. Hey, Jake. Jake. It's a two count, not a three count. So action, one, lights. Yeah? Okay. Here we go. Action. That's pretty good. If you hurry, you can see it. Yeah. I had to block like every possible avenue. Okay. What I want to do is angle you a little bit to catch more of that light. Yeah, totally. Cut you right at the end. Cool, it's still up. Yeah. Oh, it's good light. <laughs> okay, go. Cool. Go. Problem solving. Okay, I'm gonna smoke it just a little bit. <clears throat> Try that again. Cool. You Notes. Know, yes, it's mostly light based. Cool. So I. Uh, Jay! Lights! Please, I! <laughs> <laughs> That's easy. Take the element? 
think so. Fifth element, yeah. Okay, Danny, rotate uh, quarter turn to your left. Okay, now look down to the book. Put the book down. Just go through the motion for me. Yeah, we'll, we'll do it like that. Yeah, we'll just try it. Yeah. Okay, check and focus. You are good. Here we go. Okay, kill the lights! Really kind of you know, tenderly and like whatever. Here we go! Action! More like this? Yeah, it's, right. it's too tenderly anyway. Oh, the smoke? Yeah, I want it to I want it to like settle more than go away. You know? Harder. Oh. Hi, Pat. What are you doing, buddy? Kill the lights! And here we go! Action! Cut! That was a good one. Sadness in your eyes. Yeah, that was it. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Well, let's moving on. Sweet. And. Kill the back. I thought, like, some of the belt from last night. A little bit of belly. A little bit of belly. Um, alright. It's gonna be chamber. At the chamber, I don't have any fake rounds. Okay. So, uh, fair enough. Should not say that, but we do have big friends. Uh, we got that. We just got to get a chamber for the macro, and, um, and then we no. I want to try the hero shot. Okay. I kind of do it. Hi, America. <laughs> Super slow. Kind of do it a little bit. A little bit. I like this guy. How are you sweaty? You're outside. Hey, you know, it's like a uh, uh, hysterical pregnancy or something like that. Like, yeah. I feel your pain being inside sweaty. Hysterical something. Yeah. Uh, okay. Ooh. Next shot. This is the one that I really, really wanted. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Are we going to go through the motions? Yes, we will. Yeah. Hey, Danny, show me your. Okay. What's up? Go back to the holster. Okay, let's take it from one. Kill the lights. 
Here we go. Action. Exactly what you want. Yeah. How can we get closer to it? That's what I'm going to try with this one. Alright, cool. Here we go. Yeah. 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 viewers really That was it. That was it. Cool. Yeah. You want to look at it? Shit, yeah, we'll look at it. The smoke's a little heavy, but I don't mind so much. So let's get the macro. Just when that light turns on. <laughs> yeah. 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 Okay, you see it is. Okay, you guys can uh, come on in. The lights can come in. They can come on. No, they can stay on. Am I shouting too loud? No. Just loud enough. Let's just stay on now. Let's try the strobe to the doing? So are you trying with the strobe? You trying to um, set a little more textural? Textural, like hyperactive. Yeah. I want to, get I just want to see what happens. So I would say like crank the shutter speed to like one point five or two hundred if you can. And it's really loud. Uh, waste uh, strobe. I think I want to go way down. <clears throat> Which is what I need to do anyways. Uh, okay. Mitigate that. Uh, Danny? 
16. Oh boy, I just made a post. Sweet. Come on in. I just oh. want to check on the video. Yeah, totally. Uh, we'll, we'll assume that this happens on the. Uh... No, we can't do that. Is there a shot? We saw me. I'll blow and break the. Uh, oh, now you're at. Robert Flood, I know that man. He did not. He did it deep here. What? He just put the blocks down there. I don't want to be like that. Okay. Okay. That was pretty sick. I think stand out of the way in the back. No, I would say this is like. You want red? Yeah, I'll hold red. Chambers. Yep, from the point. I don't. I don't need you to bring it up in a position. We'll just go from there. Uh, I probably want to get a couple of varieties of this. But you want to do that? Yeah. So I just want to go over. I just want to go over some yeah, safety procedures. Yeah. You guys stay put. Danny. So you thumb down, and that's it. That's the trigger. Yep. Back on the floor. Back not comfortable. Taking that out. Okay, it's good. It's yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so if you want it blocked back, we just yeah, sure. block back. Yeah. This is nervous. I 
I take back that action. Physical fire is never really useful. Ah, yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Alright, okay, for this one, actually, I'm not going to see it, so I'm take the magazine off. It's going to be action chamber. Got it. Okay. Yep. Anything you want me to do different? Good? Yeah. I want to change my angle for sure. Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So, the fourth is not. See that at all? So I'm going to refocus the shot. <laughs> okay. So let's try it on the other side. Let me see. Will those go that far? Maybe you can Yeah. 
Yeah, it doesn't matter. It's not meant to get any closer. Yeah. Go ahead, Connor. Black and white. Try to get this thing over here. Try to catch on this side, you know. Okay, here we go. Looks like it has to be moved to the left. Yep, let's just shoot it. Yeah. Lights are staying on. Dan, you gotta get dressed. Cool. Yeah. Oh, big boy. Oh, big boy. Big man. That's David, the workhorse. Chris Peck's going to be the main character. <laughs> Isn't it more interesting if a fat slob saves the world? <laughs> yeah, and I'll be his, I'll be his tiny buddy. That... Hey, get up, tiny buddy! Yeah. Out here! Out here! <laughs> get him! I'll play all of his, all of his lines for like 150%. Yeah. 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 Let's go! Let's go! Just every shot is you on your knees. Hey! <laughs> wow, you look so majestic in the webcam. Uh, oh, I'm in the webcam? Yeah. Shit, son. Hello! This it's looks like me. casting couch, dude. This is getting dirty. <laughs> it's getting dirty. So, uh... What do you do for them? Uh, I think help me. I'm in college right now. Work out some. What do you got under that shirt? Under under this shirt? Yeah, if only you have the thing. <laughs> yes. We got fifteen. Hundred. Well, um, 21. 21? That's a new high. 21 what? Oh, so are they watching me right now? They are. Hello, viewers. Yes, I need to flip. Oh, yeah, I remember this routine. Don't you? You might yeah. be in Oklahoma. Except the other one. Just feel it. What the fuck is the other one, man? Cheers. This, all right, I'm going to up. Batter here, you see the open back here. Go away, Stolberg. 
Ah. You got it? Mm-hmm. Okay. Cool. Yep, that's right. Hang on. Yep, go for it. You're good. Yep. Can you say hello? Should I say hello? Say hello. Pop in there. Hi. Hi, guys. I'm Chris. I'm making a film with Danny. Not this film. I'm just helping out because I like these guys. It's a. Uh, it's a. It's called Little Wolf. Uh, Danny's in it. Uh, I direct it. Um, I always wear this red hat. I don't know why. Uh, I like to party. <laughs> I like to party. <laughs> <laughs> and he's off the party right now. Yes. Another shameless plug was with the uh, oh, Tom's. Oh, yeah. Woo. We're going to totally die down here, aren't we? Oh, let me get the... Uh, <laughs> it looks like there's a fire man. Okay. Right, so. mm-hmm. Okay. Where's that wafter? Get to wash. Wafter. Wafter, man. Yeah, you want to plug it and plug your MK back in? Am I smelling? No. I don't want it. They don't want it. Yeah, that's a lot of smoke. Let's, yeah. uh, <laughs> let's unplug that now. It's like Cedric's Hill concert in here. Why is that so hit the right here? I plugged the wrong one. Oh, man. Wow. There we go. It does look like a fire in here. Oh, that's X-Files, man. <laughs> Let's get those lights on out there so I can get set up for my. Let me just shot. run down the street like this. Yeah. Oh, it's just like one. Looking fabulous. Looking good, right? We got this in the Found that fan. Turning. Head on. Oh, oh my god, yeah, this is... Shhh. hope they don't call the fire She's department. She's like looking like a Jedi. <laughs> we told you that thing was going to be... I'm good. Hey, oh. hey, hey. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's good. That was yeah, super. Oh shit, man. Oh, man. Well, dressed up and ready to party. Come on. Um, Which RXD did? Oh, cool. Yeah, suck that in the Yeah, I'm gonna suck. I think science is the answer. Science? Yeah, it's like this is pushing all over here. <laughs> Swear to God, there's little things here. Alright, alright. Teach you a little stoner trick. There we go. <laughs> that was just kind of crack the door. Yeah. See? See, I never know if the battery's going to work. Okay, um, they're empty magazines. Are they in your vest right now? Extract one. I like, I like the one that's kind of model black. Model black. Not that one. I know, no, please get that. This one, this one, yeah, it's Black. Okay, now, in that bag there are three, um, dumb rounds? Yeah.
Um, this is a infrared laser. So when I put this, wow, that's, oh. that's ominous. <laughs> So if you're using a night vision, you have it on the IR setting. Only you can see the light. So if that zeroed in, that's all you would ever need. Oh, oh you son of a bitch, I just had it right there. How many? Uh, three. I know. Are you wearing gloves? No, I am. Oh, honey. Oh, precious. You're wearing some gloves, are you? I think we good. Everything's as foggy in real life, isn't it? I have. I've had my house look like this one. Put a bomb in it. Open the blinds and like five Here we go. Night of change. Alright, here we go. Okay, so you have the pressure switch on the thumb. Yep. I well, have three in there. I think it's just a double tap. Or else you click and hold. Yeah, I think it's just click and hold the pressure switch. Otherwise, you have the button on the top and double tap. Yeah. Ooh. Keeping that It's almost, almost as good. No point on Jake's face. Sorry. <laughs> Not really a visit. There's some bag in it. So I got three of them here, David. Is that what you wanted? I'm going to have to up the door, though. I don't want to work. No, I don't want to. Yeah. Smoking gun. <laughs> I never get. No, my camera! <laughs> here you go. Crawling on this left Sorry, hand. Jake, I wasn't trying to point at your face. I'll survive. Well. Help me survive! This long is the longest in the world. Yeah. Um. Do you guys cover your. Uh, do not line? chamber one. No. That's jams. No. Am I going to. What? Okay, pose, pose for the people. We have uh, 22 viewers. Danny is in full combat garb. As I do, kind of walk here. Yeah, let me get some bounce. Yeah, you. the light's really kind of crap. I'm, I'm going to walk into the light. Who's that? Um, well, let's see what's going on. Okay, here we go. The fun stuff begins. See ya? Yeah. Should I put the flashlight on there, you think? Or is it cool with that? I think it's cool like this. Uh, we're taking it from here, right? Yeah, so putting that in. Which, which is why I'm not going to use, or I might option, or I might save some for the trailer or whatever. Yeah. But from the draw to the and then to the stuffing of the drop leg. Yeah. And then we'll probably just fake one like this. Probably nice and low end of this direction. Just going like that. Yeah. And then, like, looking at the rifle. And I'm looking back up at the door and settling in for this wide shot. Let's get the wide shot first since we have the smoke. So let's close the door. Effect still? And uh, I don't think we're going to see anything. So um, you guys can stay in here if you like, or you can hang out out there. Because I don't need any like cues. Um, actually, you can follow me with this. No, actually, house lights are on. Yeah, yeah. If you want to turn those in the back, you can uh, at least grab the 5D and take those. Yes, sir. Oh, yeah. Or, or video. Yeah. Okay. So. Yeah. All the house lights up? Yes, please. Can throw me that stand? Okay. Yeah, stills in the video be sweet. Yeah, Cooper. Cooper duper. I need to get some of that stuff I shot in Oklahoma. I need to get some of that stuff I shot in Oklahoma. Yeah, yeah, it makes it. I'm supposed to do that. Yeah, you're bad, Fred. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I didn't. I do love you, man. It's been a long time that I don't remember that. I would do a lot of it. You know, I thought you might want to look at it. Oh, definitely. I definitely want to look at it before it's a lot of shit. I have 300 gigs. 
A lot of shit is shaky. Air butter, hang on, hell of Yeah, but I didn't do it with that. Now I'm turning the thing out. <laughs> you stuck it in the mud. I was so that. mean to that guy when he fell. You were mean. You were such a dick, though. What'd you say? I, think you I, I didn't say anything mean. He just, like, reaches for a what? hand up, and I'm like, yeah, wipe it off my camera. But you told you to redeem yourself, and you were shirtless. Oh, is that the guy? Yeah. Same guy? He sent me an email. I like him. <laughs> we're buddies now. Were you the guy without the shirts? Oh, we're, we're buddies. We're, I was just like... like I was <laughs> you guys don't link it. Um, okay, that bounce stuff needs to go away. Yeah. Do that. Video. I'm doing some behind the scenes video. Damn it! So I thought my sense was like a cheesy one line or something. Where is the. What? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh yeah. I was waiting for that son of a bitch. Oh. <laughs> okay, eyes and mouth. Tuck him. I don't know how old and stinky this is. <laughs> yes! I hate what David Sports did. Half water, half glycerin. It's oh. uh, our sweat compound. Oh, we need a little glycerin there. I don't know. Mitch got it. And I hope it doesn't run out anytime soon because I don't know. Stings the eyes. Stings the eyes. Mmm. Should I do a Dutch tilt, you guys? <laughs> yeah. Everything. Oh, it's a uh, Dutch, it's wearing blocks. Because apparently he's sweaty right now. I, oh, yeah. You just want to borrow some of my sweat? <laughs> my ass. <laughs> and get all sorts of pockets for you, mister. <laughs> got a lot of sweat for you. You know this stuff gets me out of point. Don't fuck her up to me like that, man. MLA. Okay, show me a gun. So what you're gonna do, guy, you know, is uh, that pistol thing never happened. So we're gonna start from that. We'll get that shot later. But yeah. what I want to see is basically yeah. this is this is the last shot. So it's gonna be after you just rack the bolt, right? Yeah. And I want you. Well, what stage? Stop. Is that comfortable for you? So what I want to see you do is like don't chamber it. You're yeah. Just coming away from that motion. So and I want to see you uh, from here. Imagine just letting it go. Yep. Right here. Yep. And then kind of just settle into the firing position. Yeah. Yeah. Because you're not like you don't plan on surviving this encounter, yeah. right? Yeah. You're not even like hiding. <clears throat> Go. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? You were about to roll. Hey, hey. What the hell is this? Shoot him! Okay, let's try those strobes. Let's try the strobes uh, right here. Let's, we'll see what we can get. The practical and the uh, fill is on, yeah. So, that's much better. <laughs> As we walked by, got some cool bounce off the pink shirt. Later, guys. JJ Abrams here. <laughs> okay, Jake. Yeah. What? You can take some video too. Ooh. 
you do look like you're in the middle of an after an after disaster this one. It's awful to eat. Yeah. You say it looks like shit? <laughs> Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Yeah. That's the last we ever saw of Chris. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the Daddy Kung Fu him after that. Kung Fu. Kung Fu. Kung Fu. Kung Fu. Uh, Jeet Kwon Do. Jeet Kwon Do. Jeet Kwon Do. You should just shoot this with a webcam because I can see everything I want. Hey, Danny, face the door again, here, Mark. Okay, um, we're going to stand in, Chris. So we're right up on it. Alright, smoke is looking pretty good. Oh, shit, yeah. That's uh, totally reflecting back at us. And Chris, all the information on the screen why is there an info display button? That's why I see it. No. Okay, there it is. Yeah, I can see it, but it's, it doesn't really look right. What do you mean? It looks like it's coming from right behind it. Doesn't make I sense. <laughs> yeah, so let's just not do that. Okay, okay got it. <clears throat> Alright, let's knock one out, Danny. So, uh, and let's not, uh, show me the laser. Let's just not do that. Can you see the laser? Pretty sweet all? though. Hey, Mark Casper's watching. Hi, Mark yeah. Casper. Hi, Mark. Hey, Mark. I just worked with you. Yeah, that's what he said. <laughs> he probably doesn't like you. Oh, of course. <laughs> what? what? All right, let's, let's try one. Uh, no, uh, flash. No laser. Yeah. You can use video if you like. Yeah. Um. So, Danny, it's yeah, yeah. Yeah, that'll, that'll be pretty cool. It's got good action. It reads well. So let go from there. And uh, you have to settle into it. <laughs> That's freaking ominous. Uh, I would say let's throw in all the lights and lasers we have, but it, that's a little bit over the top. It's a little Pink yeah. Floyd for my taste. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, here we go. You guys can do whatever you like. And you ready? Yeah. Action. That's real pretty. I like it. It works. It works well. Yeah. Good help. Good job. Good job. Mark, that's that FS700 I was talking about. This is the Sony FS700. I don't know how <laughs> well you guys can hear. Yeah. Um, can you do it one more time, though? Yeah. Actually, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I got you. I was just checking. So I want to go handheld and try to get in there and see what happens. When we get dirty. I'm going to get super dirty in there. Okay, show me your final frame there. Okay, 
this bounce. Can we hold it? I took the yeah. You, I took the light down. Do you want to hold this? Sure. Okay, yeah, let's do that. <laughs> I like it. Okay, here we go. Action. Gotcha. Nice. Hold up one more time. So. Uh, oh, I should. You're literally gonna throw a light at me. That's, that would be tough. That's that damn dangerous, man. <laughs> Shot. Okay, well, walk it back. 
Blue and Tigger? Mm -hmm. No, I, I took all the rounds out. Okay. Try it. Try it. Right here. Yeah. That'll work. That'll work. Yeah. That's what you want. It might fall out. Actually, the smoke is all around together. Look it up. You don't mind. Look it up. Light it up. Smoke it up. And hang it up. Okay. Yeah. You're a lost child. You're a lost boy? Get out of here. You're just going on. Which one are you? Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. 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 Go ahead and press anything else? No, it should go automatically once it's ready. Okay, I'll just stand by. Okay, so it's going to be from the uh, eye straight ahead. Wrap the same and get into your final frame. Cool. And I'm going to move quickly this time, so it's going to be fast. So, two more combats. It should be. Okay, let it go twice. You want me to just go to regular speed, right, David? Yeah. Combat speed. Oh, break it. Alright. Okay, let's uh, fan it around so we can get those tendrils to go away. Yes, we are still shooting 120 FPS. Eighteen viewers. Why do we not have viewers? I think we had like six when we shot the riot scene. Yeah, it's, but nobody knew who we were. Yeah, well, <laughs> we doubled that in now four we're years. Like, we're super famous. We now. are super famous because okay. we built that. We're kind of a big deal. I only have 1,300 fans, but I love each and every one of them. What are their names? There's David. There's Is that Amy. me cheating? There's Mitch. There's. Um, Mitch doesn't like your wolf. He doesn't? <laughs> well, still. Okay. Alright, yeah, I think you're fine there, Chris. Yeah, you're doing fine. Ready? Okay, first of all, David, take care of him. I'll have a better one. Alright. Okay, cool. Alright. Here we go. Action. Alright, Now, here, here's what I want to do. Okay, can you run up the, that light? 
you see the angle right here, how it's stopping on him. So right here, I want the angle to be right here instead. So sunlight coming in front of him. Get some interesting atmosphere from the next. Check this out. Think about this. Special. Five dollars. Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. How many did you get? That's good. Uh, I had like six. We're yeah. gonna do this again, but uh, this, this should be a little bit more interesting. Yeah. There's an atmosphere between the arm and the camera. <coughs> Want to come back in, Jake? Yeah, I, I have yeah. That. that's good. Yeah, okay. I'm trying to get closer. I don't know why. I don't like throwing Well, I just don't know. I can't see if you're actually working on something. I mean, it's going to be a little crazy. That's just cool. Yeah, yeah. Because I wanted to know if you're ready. All right. Sure. Is Are you ready? Is it buffing? The same thing then? Yeah. Here we go. Actually, no, 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 I want to scoot back with the zoom lens. So you can keep your 50. Are you just showing off now? Is that what you're doing? Sounds like you're bragging. Like I only bragging. have one lens, though. Are, are you compensating for something else? This guy? Want to see how long my lens is? His lunch is definitely longer than mine. I'll take her at the base, too. Yeah, the base, too. What does it mean if I don't have a lens? Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. Maybe I'm just so awesome, I don't need a lens for the first week. Okay, Danny. Yep. That's what I tell my lens. <laughs> Back to your mark, monkey. Up the couch a little bit. Yep, that's your, that's your play area. I'm catching some... Yeah, I'm going to redo that wide shot, actually, because I'm getting a lot more streaming. Yeah, we'll just go through the same motions. I'll actually wrap. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and the more you move your hands and body, the more light you're going to play with there. So uh, move your torso a little bit on this. Like, it's, it's it's like exaggerate yeah. a little bit. Cool. Because you're going to play with that light. All right, here we go. Here we go. Action. I don't really like the angle, but while I have the lens on, I'm going to catch a different shot. Okay, this one would be for your face if it looks like right now. Yeah. Work. 
we always repeat that mantra. Hey. Please go. Here we go. Action. Very nice. Very nice. Um, we have time to pull focus and stuff. That's only one more time. Oh, you want to pull focus? I just want to catch focus up here. Okay. So I'm not having units. Well, do you have PT on or that PT? Yeah, it was okay. I just, uh, right on. See? Well, in the way of the webcam. Yep. Okay, can you tell when the uh, shadow is thrown over your eye? Shadow. You bring it up. Like right there, it's over your eye. Can you yeah. tell? Yeah, don't, exactly. don't do that. I want to see that light staying in place. Not so good. All of it. Okay, let's try again. Here we go. Action. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay, let's just knock out. We'll have this lens on. Let's knock out the uh, extra shot. Yeah. Twenty-three. Ooh. Keep going. Oh, sweet. Oh, sweet. Pink Floyd is awesome. I agree, Mike. <laughs> Pink Floyd is great. Yeah. I'm a Who fan, so. <laughs> okay, Jake, can't you like Jake, Jake, I need the, the bounce card, like right up on his leg. <laughs> I'm fucking tattoo the Who. Right up on his leg. Woo! 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 Hey, go that way, let's come on. I got this. Hey, Gino. Yeah. Ow! Can you go to your back? <laughs> yeah, don't look at that. Okay, walk it up in there. Oh, that's better, yeah. Angle a little bit so you catch that and you throw it back at him. Don't get thrown. <laughs> okay, Danny. Yep. Let the rifle dangle. And yeah, rotate towards the door just a little bit. That's good. Yeah, right there. Okay, that's what that's what I want for Chino. You did a good boy. Oh yes, you are. Okay, I want to see the uh, from here from Sewell with the pistol to the drop leg. Yeah. Yeah. Here. Yep. Yeah, that'll work. That'll yeah. work. Okay. Stay still. Okay, here we go. Action. Hold that, hold that, hold that. Never mind, let me take it off. Okay, can we get a little bit more smoke? You're your big boy. Just chilling. Just get some pizza. So calm now, I like it. Yeah, but I'm gonna jump on your lap and make it close. Oh my god. Gino. Yeah, watch out for the pause, man. He
Hey guys, David Crowley from the Gray State Project. Tonight I'm going to be shooting a little bit for the documentary Gray State The Rise. It's something that I've been picturing for the awakening moment that is the eyes opening to appreciate the truth about our surroundings and our reality. <laughs> kind of using whatever I have. Just the stuff laying around the house to get this shot done. It'll probably show up toward the end of Great State The Rise. So I'm using my wife, Kamel, as the main subject. She ends up being my subject for most of these little shoots. Hey, say hi to the kids. Hello. <laughs> hi. But I'm just using a couple black lights, some Christmas lights. This is going to be our constellation. So we're seeing what we can get. It's hard work, right? Complicated, tricky little setup. But you look good. Thanks. Give me a smile. Looking forward to showing you guys the results. Stay tuned. Just a little bit. Everything is working. Guys, remember, bring him to me. I gotta do the checklist. Yeah, so you're gonna be right over here next to the dog, right? We gotta move the pumpkin. Yeah. What we can do with security is we can get the people out of the house and security can come down and point the weapons at the people. Yeah. Okay, you guys got the pick. Do you want the volunteer for my handler? So you can get, like right here, you can get some of this, you can get some of the house. Uh, some trees, past the trees is pretty boring. So you're just getting right. this area, right? right? Yep. And then you can move around as necessary. Mitch, I want you on that side of the tree, looking that way. Okay. Okay. I get that, put that. <laughs> okay. Alright guys, here we go, here we go! Get the crew up, set! Right. Yeah. Mitch, are you first man in? Turn it on and let's do it. Here we go, guys! I'm just gonna stick around here. Yeah. Not going up. Get the drone get up. 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 And then I'll. Hey, where's the five blades? What are you guys doing, Adam? What do you want to do? We're going to raid this house, people. There's 45 viewers. Tell your friends to tell your friends to click on. We're going to go in there. Hashtag Race State Live. Crazy rain. I know. It's the worst. Copy that. Boom. Go away. Here we go, guys. So you're going to do a lot of the body searching because you don't have a gun. Why are we still talking? Get into position. Adam, get the squad over here. Squad up. I want to spread the action. I don't want to swamp. Get it up. Okay, right here. Let's go. Let's go. Now. Move in. Secure the team. Hey, you guys want to go at the same time we do? Move in action. Make this happen. We'll take you back in and show. Camera guys, move back, move back. Here we go. Copy that. Right, here we go. go. Take these terrorists down. Do it. Roll cameras. Camera speed. Set. Action. Move. Move up. Action. Move up. Move up. Go. 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 Oh, my God. 
this time. I get a my condom in my face. It's awesome. Everybody loves some fuzzy. I really have uh, got enough. I don't need any more right now. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's a cozy. Yeah. What? 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 Alright, so Brain is good for the laptop. What? Brain's good for it. Oh, yeah. Once you have someone on the ground, you're going to have a... Do one last one and then I'll... We can put it in the cop car. Yeah, I don't know if people will see it, though. Well, better than a dying. Yeah. <laughs> what? Okay, they're starting up again. Okay, this is probably going to be the last one that you guys are going to be able to see because it's raining and I have to shut down this laptop. Oh yeah, we gotta give a shout out to Kokesh. Oh, you wanna do that right now? Sure. Okay. Uh, yeah, by the way, it's raining on the last one. <laughs> I know, I said it's the last one and then I'll take it in. Okay. So, too, we gotta give a big shout out to Kokesh and everybody else out there that's trying to get him free. Um, All right, this guys, stuff does really happen, happen to him. Ouch, oh, shot. Oh, we're shooting. It's gotta go. Do it! Do it! Do it! Stand by! 
Okay, they're shooting. Kids are watched by crooked cops And they get shot by that cop And the weapons dropped It was caught on tape His yellow tape fade Set up and let up He was owned by the state Police state cage streets No cash and need to eat Poor poor wars War the hungry need to eat No hate but no thanks I don't do Thanksgiving I'm on a mission Never since I had the premonition I've seen it all Kingdoms come and never fall Or downfall No more Walmarts and mini malls Check the message, the rain's on the wall Hits a season, the trees, and then the raw deceiving Vote to Jack, Todd Jack, World Wars are back Calls a track, phones a tap, so I pay with cash The Dow dips a hick, sips a bitch, slits a wrist A kid's pissing, loads a clip with a clenched fist Hate's born from tear storms, the devil's horns Concern the corner, they want you burned and mourn Friends are foes, souls are soul, people do what they're told We're on a road and no one knows which way to go Make a move and stay the course, freedom ain't forced He's alive and will arrive on the pale white horse Third Reich's in the Christ, super fair in life They love fright, hate love, but that ain't right I'm anti-war pro-gun and I got more than one I got a few, hate the news and I make silent moves Together we can reach the 
sky. Get a little long, strong, and like the leader's pawns. So when you tell them to, they play your favorite song. I hope they get along, everyone you love. Cause we all got a bond that we need to keep strong. See, no matter how you feel, we all want the same. A chance to see love, do away with the pain. We all pray for the day that hates drop away by the choice that we made to mean what we say. Believe me. I could do more, but I'd rather do more Like help the world avoid war And dodge the barrage And help them in the garage With everything they'll need The food and the seas now Don't run away, don't run away Don't do a stay and live to fight another day Don't run away, don't run away Don't do a stay and live to fight another day Cause we will rise once we realize That when we work together we can reach the sky I don't wanna see you scared Unlike a new law, I wanna see the tax fair I want us to survive and be left alone So our kids see what it takes to make them grown The old get to know, the young get to learn To be forever young is to be forever burned Don't listen when they sing unless it means good things I don't mean the rings, the cash or the bling Now, don't run away, don't run away Don't do a stay and live the fight another day Tunes. I sing the blues and battle cry tunes. I sing the blues and battle cry tunes. And live a beat in the world to doom. Why wait? Go ahead and tempt fate. Risk it while you can. Go ahead and take a chance to stand next to any man who's ready and willing to die for his land. Just a kid, and yeah, they took kids. Life through the sights of a guy who did his job as a sniper and killed like a viper. It's been venom when he killed him with fire. Now get higher, reach for the sky and spread your wings. We were born to fly, we were born to love. And they taught us to hate and brought us up to believe, but they keep us safe. They curse our names and tell us jet planes could change our world, cause to them it's a game. Well, I ain't playing, it's a truth I'm playing. Down on the ground with the beasts I'm slaying. From the shade that watch him as it laid, into the dark night, deep in the grave. And it ain't that way, yo, the man of Gotham. You know what's bad when they got Batman and Robin tapping the phones. That's how it's shown. It's like every other movie has the same undertone. Same plain blown, same threat grown. I feel like Samuel Jackson, that black snake moan. I sing the blues and battle cry tunes and live up beat in the world of doom. In a scope on Zoom, I flooded the back room to find a way to get away from the goons. Yeah, I sing the blues and battle cry tunes. I sing the blues and battle cry tunes. I sing the blues and battle cry tunes and live up beat in the world of doom. Let's ride and take a look inside. The mind's eye that hides the lies It keeps the secrets low in the grove So no one can see behind their evil shadow They speak of codes on country back roads And we're together with Cobra Commandos Yo Joe, I hope you make it back alive and intact Be safe in the rack and bring peace to the streets Like a priest with a peace, believe me You can taste defeat like a gnome with a rifle Armed with the Bible, you got any of the books Still throw them in the fire And then the burn to the Cold turns white and the smoke clears After a hell of a night With a hell of a fight And a hell of a way To save the very own people That you enslaved They shoot Well I'm recruiting Troops for the truth Who don't plan on losing 
It's a trick and a grand illusion They create the problem to get their solution It's a shame how they love the rage And love to play a song like Broad Stage You know they love it how they play the public See we're in charge, they're the master of puppets So keep fighting and ride the lightning Cause when a snake strikes it's a fighting time and my flag's flying day and night It says don't tread on me in black and white Yeah, I see the blues in battle cartoons I sing the blues in battle cartoons I sing the blues in battle cartoons And live a beat in the world to do Weekend here in New England. It'll be fun. I'm excited to hang out with Stuart Rhodes. It's Alan Watts. It's our turn on the green. It's our turn in the front ranks. Let's go. That's the shit. Documentary Jersey Rise. We were able to observe the National Guard about a company, you would say about 150 of them, at Boston Common. It was a typical like handshaking, thank you for your service kind of thing, which is really disturbing to me because I know the nature of their service. They did reveal to us that yes, they've been cross-training with police to do uh, cordon and search and lock down intersections, things of that nature. They were not aware of posse comitatus, they did not understand the irony of their situation. The military is to be used as a battering ram a tool of foreign policy, something to be mistrusted at best and feared at worst, and not to be used as domestic law enforcement. We're here to protect you, and we just watched a bunch of 18, 19, hey, hey, waving at the soldiers, thanking them. Pretty much the gray state that we've all been anticipating, watching these guys just suck up the admiration of people on the site. It's not going to be a slow slide into, you know, just, just look at this uh, velvet glove tyranny we want to submit to on our knees. You know, it's not going to go down like that. Well, all signs are pointing to the gray state is going to occur, but the Patriots will have their day. It's getting to that point really soon. Um, from what we experienced over the course of this weekend, it's going to be you know, pretty, uh, pretty interesting territory for the bad guys. When we went on to Lexington Green, the permit had been pulled to do the rally, but Stuart Rhodes went there with full intent and understanding that he would be arrested that day for his, hey, <laughs> we know we're not allowed here, but we're going to go on anyway. They thought it was right combat veterans from the American Revolution to renew their oaths here, then it's right for us to do so too. And the selectmen of Lexington can stop us. Ready and willing to commit what we call criminal acts just by non-compliance, non-participation, and non-recognition of these illegal laws. So we couldn't get into Watertown. Luke Radowski managed to get in. I haven't heard from him since. I hope you're okay, Luke. <laughs> I think you guys are kicking ass. And unfortunately, I think that you know, events are overcoming you, and so I hope you get it made before it all happens. <laughs> you're speaking for most of our fans. Right? Yeah. <laughs> and again, we need your guys' help, and you guys have been doing an incredible job. But keep plugging Grace State for the film, and also Grace State The Rise, the documentary that's going to be coming out shortly. Spread that information. Don't hold back, don't pull the punches. We've been at this for over two years, and it's, o it's only your interest that has kept us going, because why would we work so hard if no one is paying attention? Incredibly gratifying to meet the fans out there who support Grace State Die Hard, and actually seeing the Grace State in action firsthand at Boston, I think uh, really kind of put things into perspective on what we're doing and the direction we're taking it. The uh, Special Forces personnel, the veterans, yeah. the, the sheriffs, Everyone is a Grey State fan even if they don't know it yet. The audience, you guys, the thinking audience, are sick of the bullshit. Yeah. And it's time to get the real messages injected into mainstream entertainment. I think the choice really is between 1934 Germany and 1774 America. We have done that throughout our history. All of our enemies underestimate us. The current domestic enemies underestimate us as well. The fact that so many people choose, and I do mean choose, to stick their heads in the sand. Fighting for freedom costs a lot, but losing it costs everything. Only the guilty fear the truth. Because we have truth, we have passion, we have love for the Constitution. It is not a privilege, it's a goddamn right. We need to recognize our own responsibility. The fact that we have not defended this Constitution and this Republic enough to prevent what's happening right now. People like us who are awake, we don't have that option. 
We don't have a choice. Do what you guys do best, cause some havoc in the name of liberty, and get this message heard. You guys are looking for the truth, and by this time it's too late to be scared. So check that out. Is that Illuminati? <laughs>